welcome to Off Topic. We are Cheers. not live. Um, what? What's, it's New Year's, bro. Today's what? The 30th? Yeah. The, yeah. Uh, <laughs> if you're watching this, you know, uh, bright and early, uh, it's almost 2022. Wow. Uh, I'm your host, Michael. We got Lindsay, Hello. Matt, Joe. Hello. Uh, some little flower. Pots, what are these? They really do look like little they, they look like vases. Yeah, now. yeah the they small look, I, I, It feels um, insulting to a vase to call it a vase, and in, the in, the inscriptions on it is kind of so blurry. I can't read what it says. I oh, never wait. learned. Yeah, how there's I letters never, on how there. Do you but, read glass. Uh, how do you? How <laughs> I need my glasses glass. to read this. Look, Hang on. Is, <laughs> one, one moment. Authentic. Oh, you got it. Authentic. Wow. Hundred percent glass. Yeah, at the bottom. There you go. So it's. It's, All it is it's is what it is. It's authentic 100% recycled. We wow. Learned we learned wow. so many there. words. <laughs> right. Damn it. That uh, was really hard That to was read. pointless to read because I could have looked at that and assumed it. Um, <laughs> here's the other thing, Chat's right? loving it. So though. this it's is, up. this <laughs> is the 30th. If you're watching this, as soon as it drops, uh, at, you know, we're supposed to start at 3. We usually start at 305 to 310. I'm not taking blame on this one because it's pre-taped. When this airs at 320... Don't look at me, okay? Uh, but it's probably like 3.15. Um, day of today, now, real world, Spider-Man Day. Oh, yeah. yeah. Spider Is this a national holiday, international holiday? Uh, now, I, for a lot of people, yeah. apparently. Yeah. Um, I, feel like I, I, well, I look, like, I want to see Spider-Man. We talked about this before. But when you're around people like Sarah and Alfredo. Now, Sarah, it's particularly Spider-Man. Alfredo, obviously, it's like the whole of the everything. MCU. It's, yeah, everything, yeah. it's everything. He loves all his children. He loves um, yeah. all his well, comics. Cool, everything. Yeah, like enough. I, yeah, I like Marvel. I like Spider-Man. Cool. I'll see it. Um, I did not get excited until I came into work today when Sarah proclaimed, it's Spider-Man Day. Nothing can ruin my day. And I went, <laughs> Michael's like, I feel Shall like, I, went, I feel like That's today could true. be the worst day for you. <laughs> <laughs> and so I've just been slacking her things about Spider-Man all day. And uh, she stopped looking at them. So then I started printing things out and handing them to her. <laughs> What's the most realistic Spider-Man spoiler you've seen? Nothing. To her? Nothing. I didn't send her anything. Oh, that's really? right. She, was... she even said to me, she even said to me, she goes, after I see the movie, like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tweet these so people know you were giving me fake spoilers. And I said, Sending you a drawing that someone made of Shrek <laughs> in a Spider-Man suit, I don't think is a fake spoiler. Exactly. Did you think that was going to happen? But every every time I sent her a picture, I would put a line with it. And Does, I just, well, DreamWorks I mean, now? you didn't see Mike Myers. I sent, I like, sent oh that God. picture and I attached the, the text. I think I said, Get out of my uh, way. new spinoff announced. <laughs> Um, then I kept, then I said, I sent her one. I said, don't look. And it was a picture of Blue Electro because oh. I kept telling her, uh, they lied. He is still going to be blue. Um, <laughs> then I sent her a picture of Tom Holland doing like theater, right? Which yeah. is, it looks like probably even pre Spider Man. I'm sure. And I said, LA, I said, right? just found yeah. out yeah. they're recreating the Spider Man 3 dance scene. <laughs> and I was like, that's just a picture of him. Awesome. <laughs> so she's like, these. <laughs> These spoilers. Well, it wasn't there one that you showed me. It was like My Miles Morales. Dude, dude, we were joking <laughs> about it, and I just started making shit up. And and uh, oh, I also went up to her and I said, "Hey, Sarah." I also went on my phone. I said, "What do you think will happen if I type spider into Google?" And I got to like S P I D, and she's like, "Get away! Get away! Get away! Get away from me!" That was probably the closest to a real spoiler. spoiler you're probably um, but it wasn't even Google. Uh, <laughs> I ended up Googling after our conversation, Spider-Man boogers. <laughs> and like one of the first results was an issue of one of the comics. I think it was like a Miles Morales uh, Spider-Man comic from this year. And it was an article about it. And it was like in the newest episode, Spider-Man saves someone with boogers. And I was like, you got to be fucking kidding me. And it was an actual, <laughs> it was an actual <laughs> thing. Oh, like, yeah. yeah. And so, and so that one, I, that one I printed out. Uh, and then there was like a headline and I took a marker and I erased a bunch of words just to make a different sentence. And I think it's, it spelled out something like, uh, Spider-Man saves, uh, Spider-Man is defeated, but saves self with new gross ass. Cause I try to get ass. Oh. But it, uh, but it, I was, and then, and then, uh, <clears throat> then there was one more, which I think was like from like a 20 year old Spider-Man cartoon where he's just like a spider <laughs> wearing the suit. Right. And he's like ripping through the, 
suit. Oh. I don't even know if she saw that one. I took that one <laughs> and I taped it into the kit in the kitchen. I was wondering. And I wrote was. and okay. I wrote at the top of the page, Tom? Question mark, question mark, question mark. <laughs> oh, and then a oh, and then oh, a oh, frowny oh. face at the bottom. I didn't realize that you're the one that put that oh, up. Of <laughs> yeah, that one see see Joe, I got enough. I saw enough and I put that one I went, I don't even need to see this. I just taped it up and I walked away. It just said Tom and and the printer the printer it's all black and white too. So it wasn't even it wasn't even color. I went up to Michael Limblad when he was um he was running the stream for STF. I was like, hey, do we have a, there a printer somewhere in this building? He was like, don't you guys have a printer? I go, mm -hmm. I don't know, I don't print anything. And then John was over there, he goes, We have one, but it's only black and white. And I said, that'll do fine. <laughs> and so I just stood at the printer for 15 minutes trying to figure out how to print these these screen grabs off my phone. Just to bother Sarah. That's it. And then even even the booger one, I didn't want to just like I but the first thing was I wanted her to leave her desk so I could put it there, and then she never left. So I went over to Caden, who sits on the opposite side of Sarah, and I just walked up to Caden, and I handed them the paper. And Caden was just looking at me like, what? Just laughing. And then Larry came over all like this. And I was like, yeah, I don't know. What do you think? And then I finally went, Sarah, what do you think? And I, just, I just handed it to her, and she was just like, why? Uh, and then I also kept telling her, she said, so the, there's a big group going tonight. Uh, I think it was like 7 o'clock. And Sarah goes, I'm not even going with you. She's like, I'm going at eight. So by the time your movie's over, I'll be in the theater. You can't spoil it. Like, I'm actually going to spoil it for her. Uh, and I go, where, where are you going? Oh, I'm going to this theater. I was like, well, that's the one we're going to. And I go, which, which theater are you in? She tells me her theater and her seat. And I go, Why? and I go, what is she doing? So, so at like nine o'clock, if I just, far too if I just get out of my seat and then I come into your theater, and I just find you and I say, you're not going to believe what happens in 45 minutes. <laughs> you know what you should do? You should text Sarah in the middle of our movie. Yeah, just, says, just text her. Spoiler, well, see the, spoiler alert, Iron Man died. See, oh. see, the thing is, see, the thing is, see, the thing is, I'm sure she, like, won't ever phone. And, you know, it's like Alamo or whatever. And I go, I'll just, I'll just find yeah, you. Like, you, you and she goes, could do And that. she goes, well, they'll throw you out of the theater. And I go... That's fine. I'm not even in your showing. <laughs> Michael will be kicking yeah. and screaming as security is dragging away. Like, Sarah, Sarah, he dies. Right. He dies, and, Sarah. And the best part, the best the part boogers. is. <laughs> they're everywhere. They're everywhere. I was doing that more or less throughout the day. And then someone else was talking to Sarah a few hours ago. And they go, oh, are you like, oh, are you going tonight? And I, I go, well, as far as Sarah's aware, yes. And she's like. You're not even going? I go, I'm not seeing it tonight. I'm not even seeing the movie tonight. <laughs> <laughs> so I love Spider Day now. I got my fill. I'm excited. Reasons. Yeah. <laughs> now, okay, we joke about the whole booger thing. Like, not neither. Not a joke. He saved the life. He neither confirmed nor denied that there are boogers. How did he confirm? It was confirmed. Oh, I just yeah, read the headline. I didn't read the article. It was like an actual article. issue okay. of Miles Morales. Yeah. Like, yeah. The uh -huh. Really? Yeah. Oh, my God. I, I, right. We had that conversation. I found it. Went, this is crazy. I came over to all Fredo, who, uh, again, is still it. Mm -hmm. Spoilers. And I'm telling him about it. He goes, why, why are you talking to me? That's what he said. He looked at me and said, like, why are you talking to me? And I was like, Wait, it's from a comic from five months ago. True. And he was just like, I don't, I don't want to see it. I don't care. Don't talk to that, me. I don't want to. I don't want to get away. It's, it away. sounds like Daily Bugle propaganda. It does. Spider Man's boogers. Boogers. That's how he saved. You want to be saved it. with boogers? Damn it. <laughs> it's sickening. I, know, I have fun. Uh, I like also just thinking about like, that's official. And I'm wrapping my head around that. My brain thinks like, I think it'd be funnier if you had some kind of booger affiliation with a superhero. Hear me out. I just want one moment where Alfred comes up to Batman. And he goes, sir, you got a bat in the belfry. And then he just looks at him okay. like, and then goes off to fight and then, then Batman with his boogers. Batman just looks yeah. with his what? No. Why are you talking? <laughs> Batman does not wipe his boogers off. He goes, I know. Yeah, he and then, he he I'm pretty sure Batman. He doesn't go. He doesn't go. Where are they? <laughs> yeah. He, just, he, just, he doesn't sniff. He just goes. He either lets here's the around. He either lets yeah. it drip or he eats his boogers. Dude, could you imagine if Batman was a sniffer though? It's like some crime organization <laughs> like meetings happening in Batman the background. You're no. Like, yeah. What was that? What was that? Oh, no. I mean, what you, I mean, sometimes I need something to suppress my sniffs. Hey, you have any Here's the problem. Sometimes you just got a runny nose, and everybody can't take Benadryl. I can't take Benadryl. So I do Benadryl. Screw Benadryl. Oh, well, Benadryl. It'd be hard, yeah. It'd be, my ass it, yeah, it, it, like, imagine makes, Batman the, taking Benadryl. The he problem just falls is, off the tower. Benadryl makes me really, really <laughs> tired. That down. No. But I still won't go to sleep. So it's just like, <laughs> just it's just like, like gives me a headache, and it makes me cranky. And so I just don't take it, right? And so then I'm sniffing all day when I got a cold. That's why you're not a superhero. Yeah. I mean, there's <laughs> ways you're not a superhero. Yeah. Just, just also, watch this man around. Sorry. Be Michael Myers. Real talk to you. I'll ask you too. Um, controversial opinion. I want the Spider-Man 3 dance in this Spider-Man movie. Mm -hmm. I want it to be recreated in the way that we just talked about. But I'm serious. How do you all feel about that? I feel about what? 
No, like but I want that exact me? choreography. I don't think they're gonna Tom do it. Tom Holland with emo hair. I don't <laughs> make it happen. Uh, I don't yes. think they're gonna I don't do know it. If that'll really work. I don't. It might be. It might be. Cool. We have multiple. I think. I, I think. I think. I think, be, I think in in the realm of like how uh, how much Marvel knows there are people like Alfredo. Um, there could be like a little nod to it, right? Mm -hmm. It might yeah. be like a hair flip. Or something. Well, they go yeah. get it. If they they're not gonna recreate it. Tony Stark, <laughs> 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 no, really at least you know his voice was a little bit. It, like imagine that like, he's doing like the whole dance. He's like, hey. Like, yeah. would be, <laughs> and and now I am. Yeah. Like, it's it's awesome. Awesome. Some sort of amazing. cafe scene, yeah. and someone went like, <laughs> <laughs> we're like, this or something. Yeah, like, like, they do like a little that. like this shit. Or maybe oh yeah. Even that. Even that. That surface level of like, you don't have to be an MCU fan or like a comic book fan. You could just see the movies, and then they go, and then you go so it's from the other one that's what i would yell in the theater i go like the other one <laughs> the alfredo stuff again as i've talked about a million times is like did you did you see that did you see that did you see the plane in the background right more realistic <laughs> real realistic real i'm still thinking level? of black crystal sorry she was here with us it was phenomenal more realistic, realistic. prediction i want gwen stacy back i thought emma stone was fantastic Nowhere? as gwen stacy Get it? You're gonna kill me Do like it. Gwen? I'm nowhere near you. Also, he, I mean, he didn't kill he didn't her. He killed her with the. He just the didn't say yeah. try hard enough. Yeah. <laughs> he didn't really. Yeah. I mean, he tried. You think he felt that way for forever? I, you guys <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that way. There might be See? a good comment books about it. <laughs> Perfect. That sound like echoes. It, yeah. Also, Brown, this was too. a great trust exercise in our marriage. It wasn't trusting at all. You guys were wincing and ducking. <laughs> The That's fact that not I was trust. still on set and didn't leave frame. Who's on <laughs> set? Gets in you know when people take out champagne and everyone runs out of the restaurant? Yeah. <laughs> As they process. should. <laughs> is this apple juice, by the way, Tyler? Yeah. He doesn't know. Sparkling. Is it, is it cider? Yeah, is it sparkling cider? cider or is it champagne? So that the kids feel like they're part of the adult Not yeah, I don't yeah. want to go to hell. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. It's it's Shramsburg Jesus is Mirabelle <laughs> Brut. He's, he's just a baby. Good. He can't see anything. He doesn't know. He won't remember. <laughs> Stupid baby. Idiot. <laughs> don't, <laughs> don't, don't drink. Laying in the manger. That's Born cute. like a week ago, it's an animal. I'm going to go out of limb here <laughs> without having tried this and say there's no possible way this could be as bad or worse Ooh. than that, that holiday crap from last That's week. Holiday truly. That was wow. disgusting. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, I'm, oh, I know no. we do. I was going to add more to that because oh, oh, yeah, it was very it's about 90% uh, yeah. boobs. A lot. But Sorry. I guess that's the more more bubbles the classier right that's yeah, what you pay true. for oops well, good lord the you're classy as fuck i'm very classy <laughs> why i gotta wait day classy is he going like to call it the classy now? yes please with uh is this how you pour wine my favorite <laughs> It sounds like yeah, right. someone's <laughs> urinating. That was it. That was it like someone's urinating. <laughs> every bartender in chat is just going. <laughs> yeah, uh, every bartender no! in chat's always pouring this. Yeah, this at the fancy bar. Four dollar <laughs> bottle, I'm sure. Tyler. Right, whenever, right. whenever he opens yes, it. The... 25? Yeah. Oh my god. Matt, go. lick this up. Here we go. It's a waste. <laughs> we can't all go to the country drop, club. I'm sorry. 25 yeah. Whenever he opens it in the bar, he just screams duck and cover. I mean, did you get? We're going to clear. Sorry. <laughs> oh, no, I was saying, go back to <laughs> Always. With Alfredo. So you think yeah, Gwen's going to be there? The yeah. put it over here. here. Alfredo lately is, every time Spider-Man comes up, he just brings up Red Venom. Yeah. <laughs> like, anywhere we go. Like, anywhere. <laughs> we can be, like, in public. And, and it was just like, mm -hmm. uh, Joe, are you excited for Spider-Man? And he goes, Red Venom. What you'll, what you'll, so I can, <laughs> what you'll see it. Quickly, doing what it. you'll quickly pick up on. I'm sure you've already picked up on, but you will um, embody the more you're here and involved in this nonsense is that will be everyone there will be like, nah, nah, nah. then we'll go one room over and someone will go, what the hell are you talking about? And you just go, I don't worry about it. It's too, it's too much. It's too, it's too much. Because now you're talking about the, like, even even the red venom in the sumo was like, that was a thing Eric told me on a whole other thing <laughs> that the whole story with that was like a friend of his was like, playing a multiplayer game online or something and some kid was talking about the the new carnage movie and he's like i'm gonna go see venom and red venom yeah and he thought that was funny so he told it to eric so eric told it to me so we kept saying red venom so then eric uh, so then alfredo put red tape on it and, and then alfredo, venom. Uh, alfredo red venom like, and then everyone just kept life, saying right? red venom brought it back to life and then now it's it's so stupid awesome. <laughs> it's such a dumb path my question <laughs> cheers to the end of the, the nightmare to red venom. and to a brand new nightmare because yeah. it's to the spider-man 3 Dance. Yeah, for yeah, forever. Flip. To Miles Morales' boogers. May they save us all. Mm -hmm. uh, I wish I could have it's drunk. not good, but it's certainly not bad. The last one. Not it's not lie. the worst I've ever had. No, it's it's, it's, it's right. it almost tastes like <clears throat> apple. 
Well, it's not. It's supposed to be champagne. I, I mean, I, yeah. no, I know, but it's still like fruit flavored champagne. I think you meant asshole. Um, well, regular champagne doesn't taste like apple. Not too bad. I know that. I'm just saying it <laughs> yeah, still tastes like a cider, is all I'm saying, to me. <laughs> yeah, it, it tastes like a cider. You like your dry bones roast, right? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Mm. Now, also, like, this isn't great. It's okay. If this if if this is what asshole tastes like, that's probably the oh, best yeah, tasting asshole. I was just saying. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just saying. Like, there's a different maybe, scale. Maybe Fredo's Champagne, not, uh, asshole. We, we what about what? And we, you yeah, know, we you know, I, had second sense. thoughts. I don't even yeah, know if yeah, asshole you know? is kink shit. I think that's. It depends. I think it depends on what you're doing with the asshole. Is kink uh -huh. shame. Yeah. Kink, yeah. Kinky shit. Yes, okay. absolutely. Because, like, I don't know. I'm just saying, like, yeah, example, every day. We have standards here. Every day that goes by, every year. <laughs> yeah, asshole. yeah. This guy's a little more normalized, I think. I don't really know if we should be bringing up kinks because I said something. Well, I think I think we should because that's a perfect point, right? Now, what's is asshole kink or is like cock and ball torture? Because that's what you said. So if someone said that, okay, well, I know. Cool. Yeah, listen, one listen, screams okay, kink. We have the intersectionality okay. of asshole what? torture. Okay, Matt, Come on now. Okay, okay. Let me tell the story. Okay, so we were we Please. were we were playing uh, medium. And me and Alfredo, I was in the stream, right? I left for two seconds and I come back. Me and Alfredo basically fucked shot. up our first words, right? And then it ended up with dick and rope. And then yeah, okay. I looked at Alfredo. I was like, you, I was like, you know what this is? No, it's sticky. And then we both said it, and I said three, two, one. And I don't know what he said, but I said cock and ball torture. I think Alfredo. That was a pretty hard one to guess. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, what did I yeah. say? But then Alfredo was just like, he just looked at me. He didn't say a word. He didn't make a face. He just looked at me like. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He was like. <laughs> What kind of shit are you into? The disappointed. But then you got it, right? Awesome. Then you got yeah. it, though, right? Wasn't? Didn't you both say kink or something? It was a kink at the end, right? Because yeah. that was the second round, and well, then you, yeah, the third round. There's nothing it. else you can say about cock and ball torture. I uh, like, the doctor visit. I, yeah, well, <laughs> maybe. There's probably a couple of things. I was thinking, like, we what your problem is. We've jokingly <laughs> talked about people. Happy holidays. Dudes <laughs> ejaculating <laughs> holidays or yeah. Well, we'll say like, if you're super dehydrated, they're like like ropes. We've made that joke in we videos before. before. So yeah. that could maybe, if we we're playing medium with me, I'd be like, come, <laughs> semen. But no. Mm. Now I think you you what analyze this like a scientist. Was this inside okay. anybody? No, okay. not that I know. It's, what the see, fuck it's is a, this? It, he just said it was a sex taser. It is a oh. sex taser. So this, but... Michael, give yourself a shot. This so goes your... in and then on? It was for extra. So, so, don't hand it to me and answer, because that's what you just look, did. Michael, we, just, we you whispered the sex of taser <laughs> and handed it to me, <laughs> and now you're going, I don't know what it is. I've never even seen it before. You it looks like it would go in and on. Just do a little. Just it do a does. Little. I, we never got it to the bottom It wasn't in anybody. It's the elder one. <laughs> yeah. You don't now imagine that's your butthole. Barely even feel it. Well, I imagine it would be quite the sensation <laughs> on your butthole. It's on fire, yeah. But I mean, that's like, I did burn my hair, though, because I can smell that. Oh, well, free waxing. Awesome. I mean, it definitely isn't a, a damn. <laughs> that's not a sex I can All right. Yeah. I can wait. That's, it's a bad uh, fly zapper. Oh, I remember how we got to cock and ball talk now. <laughs> Dick and rope. I never forgot. Why? Yeah, but it was. Okay, we were so there already. You know what? I, you know what I need. Damn it. You know what I need. You know. You know what I'm missing. Hmm. I found it. Let me go to the store. Now, you know when you get a house, you buy what you think you need, and then as you live there, you buy what you find you need, and you go, ah, where is? Where's the sex taser? Here, oh, now we have one it's if anybody the asks. Sex taser cabinet. <laughs> and then you just have that up in like the middle of Under like, the sink. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Like on like a on like a on Well, like you a put shelf. it you put it like a um, put it in the junk drawer. And then put you say it looks like a fancy candle. But you then. also you put one of those <laughs> well, like um, what it really is. You know like when you were a kid cuz we've moved on past this, but when you were a kid the fast no, way to get your back. To get your temperature check was the ear thing and they put the little plastic cup on it cuz then they just throw it away they wouldn't have to wash. You do one of that for this. You have this next to like a bunch of sleeves, so you can use it and then just throw it away, and then put a new sleeve on it. Now, hear me out. In my so experience, then anybody can, of it's clean. People sure. I know they, they, who have sex guests, toys. Anyone? Forget. There's one of two kinds of people. Either the people who have like shrines set up, basically, and they're like, "Oh, I had this like tightly locked away." Like, 
and they like pull like, out the dildo. Like that Helga Pataki like shrug yes. in the closet. But for adults, I guess. Mm -hmm. Sure. Anywho, um, or there's the opposite where it's people who are just like, dude, they'll leave it everywhere and anywhere. And you're like, come on, man, you left your vibrator on the living room. Yeah, but there's floor. a third. Like, there's the a third. What the fuck? There's a third. Well, there's a third. Well, there's a third. Well, there's a third. Well, 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 there's also the shrine that's not locked up. I'd almost be impressed it's, if I walked into someone's there, home that way. Locked. Yeah. Right. Yeah. It's for all to see. So, like, then you, yeah. like, have people, and then uh, you hear stories about, like, their children going into their stashes. I mean, that's a weird one yeah. to have yeah. on full display if you have children. No, yeah. Well, yeah, not I the full display, but, like, right. the, unlock, the unlock stashes. Oh, yeah, sure. Have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you have your kid run up to you, and it's like, what is this? Yeah, Properly secure your uh, firearms and your playthings. A weird bat. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> now, Joe, please, uh, take us back to the ball and cock torture. Oh, I feel no. like there was a point there. What was it? Yeah. Yeah. Joe, I saw him. Okay. I saw him. He was drowning. Okay, <laughs> so the, life trap. the words were hang. I'm like, how are you doing back there? <laughs> the words were hang and equipment. And so what do you hang off of when you're, like, rock climbing? Hang and equipment. Oh, rope. Oh, cock yeah. the ball no, that's good. Well, I said rope, and okay. Alfredo said dick. Okay. Rope makes more so, sense. So, yeah. I don't think I've ever hung off a dick before. Mm -hmm. You be haven't pretty, lived. You know, yeah. Yeah. That'd yeah. be pretty <laughs> much <laughs> sure. That'd be pretty Tell impressive. you what. <laughs> but <laughs> then that's how we got to When you're clinging to a chode wow. for your life. <laughs> it's, it's well, that would be really hard, because that would mean that, like, I probably wouldn't have a good grip on it. I disagree. Joke. You got the wide. Well, because if it was well, wider, it, then I wouldn't it, be it, able to it grab. grabs you. <laughs> I mean, how many long, shafty things do you climb on but when you rock climbing? If you think about it, if if it was a, a, uh, a regular, well, now, I'd get distracted. Day, <laughs> right? It wasn't a chode. Mm -hmm. Then if I started slipping, at least I would have a little bit of mm -hmm. give. Oh, you have like seconds to think about your life yeah, before you die. Yeah, yeah before you before fall. You, before I fall. <laughs> oh. Before I fall after oh. hanging onto a dick. <laughs> if you're lucky, you die. <laughs> 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 it's it's weird that the last thing you hear before you die is someone else screaming. There's my god! Hurry up! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Please! Ah! This fucking guy is hurt! <laughs> Sorry, I, I got confused. I thought you could hell her coffee and get out of here, but no. <laughs> I can if you're not holding it! <laughs> Please, I can't, I can't hold on anymore. <laughs> That's where you need to do Squid Game, and then everyone goes like this, there like go. in tug of war. It's like fall back. I guess like thinking about medium word association and with the the whole red venom aspect. I'm thinking about playing with Fredo, and I'm like, what would my connection be with him? I'm like, it would have to be superhero related. But now I got to break down every superhero by like two descriptive words. Like yep. it can't just be Superman. It's like cape dude, flying cape guy. Or like, like I don't know. Superman yeah. is two words though. Well, one word it's Superman. It's the redhead argument. It's one word. It into yeah. one word. Yeah, I guess he, yes. he jammed it. But it together. is a super like a Clark Clark man. Yeah. 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 yeah, that's straight up super. Because you don't yeah. even know Clark Kent's not Superman. So, Excuse me? He's just uh, a guy. You just don't know who no he is. No shit. Yeah. Neither are you. What? I don't <laughs> obviously Clark Kent isn't Superman. Joe, take off your glasses. Duh. Huh? Who the fuck is this? <laughs> <laughs> Security? <laughs> <laughs> Shit, Joe, you just, some guy just wandered in here. Jeez. <laughs> 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 oh, awesome. Um, I mean, you guys know, I guess, a little bit more about superheroes than this side of the table. I don't know. I'm not that super into DC. Oh. Just, I, I mean, I get it. Yeah. You're not. You're not wrong. You just sound like you're four. You no, sorry. Superheroes. Yeah. I don't like him. I'm I know that, but I mean, person. it's just you know, it's. I would say more like they know more about comics. Fine, right? Yeah. Like, like well, I don't think Joe knows Superman personally. Like, he no. knows more about him. Yeah. Like his life. Is he nice? no, I've never met him before. Yeah. You know what I mean? cool. I'm pretty sure I've, I've seen him flying through the sky. Definitely him or a bullet. Him you're ready to come to the meetings. Yeah. <laughs> his mother Martha is lovely. All right, superhero super fans. Yeah. We're now adjourning. You have to leave. You're not a super fan. Get out of here. There's, actually, there's no one actually. For there. people who don't know comics, and then also thinking about how I discuss things with my children, is like Iris doesn't know certain words sometimes, mm -hmm. so she'll describe it. Um, like one time she was trying to talk about the placemat we have outside where you wipe your feet before you come in the house, and she called it the outside carpet. And I was like, oh, that's it's a welcome mat, but mm -hmm. that's funny. That is what it is. So I'm like, how would you explain certain superheroes? Like, I guess well, to I my know. kids and stuff. The yeah. Flash would be Fast, fast Man. man. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Or, run, or, run quick or Nike. Just call him Nike. Oh, shit. Well, yeah, basically, it's just the goddess or Nike. Yeah. You have to explain Nike and Reebok. Adidas. Or Adidas. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Am I your Jordan? These are shoes. Okay. And also I just, gods. Well, what, what's, what's easy about kids, though, is you do it early enough, though, when you say, you don't have to say, is the Flash, and they go, why? And they go, because that's his name, dude. Who's Flash? Yeah. And they go, oh, okay. Mm-hmm. 
You call him Running Man. That kid's just like, my favorite superhero is the Running Man. And other kid's like, what the yeah. fuck are you talking about? That's the Flash. What? Like, I watched a... Why, why, why was I lied to? It's crazy. It's crazy just because of, like, pop culture in general. Stuff like Batman Super, stuff that's, like, timeless. But it, especially even now, like, Pokemon, right? It's been around forever. And then there's even, like, like indie games or popular games. It's crazy how much, like, our kid knows about that without ever even knowing what it is or where it's from right mm -hmm. like like she knows what uh huggy wuggy is from oh. the from that new okay. game yeah from uh, uh because um, it's everywhere uh poppy's Pop playtime Pop oh, right? yeah. because, Poppy because it's thing, a right? thing yeah. I hated it. Yeah. right and so now it's like it's in roblox it's in roblox it's in like animations it's just like she'll just watch shit and then i'll be like who's that and she goes oh it's this guy and i was like how do you know and she's like oh it just mm -hmm. is it's that's so weird. Yeah. Do you know where that's from? Oh, it's from this other video. And yeah. it's like a YouTuber, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like using the skin or whatever. That's why I've said this before. Like I I saw some of the games in Squid Game before I got there. I started watching the show and then a couple days or like a week or whatever went by and I didn't finish it. And then I saw some of the games in Crap games? Roblox oh, videos. Okay. Right. Roblox. And I went, oh, I wonder if this is really in the show. And then I watched the show and I went, oh, oh, yeah. oh it is. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, like the glass game. Yeah. Which that's funny because that's gotten us into some interesting conversations with parents or like my parents when they're watching the kids and they've watched Squid Game. But Iris mentioned the girl in Squid Game. She goes, let's play Red Light, Green Light. No, I was playing Red Light, Green Light with her yesterday. Yeah. And so my parents are like, you let her watch Squid Game? I'm like, no, oh my God. Red but like, she knows all about it. Yeah. Because a robot. Right. Person, but, so, I mean, yeah. but she, she, she does it. Green light. But yeah. it's not <laughs> Red Light, Green Light. It's Red Light, Green Light. With the girl. She, yeah. she holds yeah. the Barbie doll and turns the head yeah. around and goes, it's and like the robot. The too, yeah. Oh, yeah. okay. Then it's like and so And so, like, I was playing with her. And then, you know, then I had to do it. And then her younger sister was playing. But, like, she's almost three. So she kind of gets it but she doesn't fully get it and so you know we're doing red light green light and so we're moving and then we stop and then so she's doing the robot and her younger sister's playing but she just moves slow the whole time and never <laughs> stops because she doesn't understand what's happening uh -huh. she'll be like green light and she's moving she go red light and she just keeps moving slowly <laughs> Green light, red light, and then it was like the best big sis moment where we did that a couple times, and I just kept telling her, I'm like, she, she doesn't understand. She's not stopping because she, she doesn't understand how the game works. And then she did it one more time, and she goes, green light, and just let her go the whole way. And she's like, I didn't do red light. <laughs> and I was like, that was a solid move where right. she just like did, she just let her win by never doing red light. Well, because she would green light it anyways. So. Yeah, I mean it's true, yeah, but but again, stuff, right? there's there's very fickle times, both in age in general, but also just attitude of the day, where that's ha, she doesn't know how to play the game, or why are you playing the game right? And so you're always going, please don't be the second one, please yeah. don't be the second one, yeah, please, 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 she doesn't understand. I beg you, it's like the four year old's like, why won't she play? Right, right. I'm like I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry for her sins. She doesn't understand. She's a she cool should basis, stop. Though. When it's red light. Today, and that day she was generous. She went, she was. I will green light you. Or also just think of robot connection. Like one time Iris woke up in the middle of the night. She's like, I just had a nightmare. I was like, oh, I'm so sorry. Like, come over here. What's going on? And she's like, I dreamt Pennywise was there. I was like, blah, blah, blah. you yeah, haven't seen it. it. I'm like, it. She was with Pennywise. Yeah. I was like, there's Again, no way we've robots. watched it. And she was like, I watched the Roblox with Pennywise. I was like, oh, okay. Well, hang on. It's fine. It's not real. Like, it's okay. But yeah. Just a weird time to be alive, I guess. My yeah. kid knows everything. Then I went. Yeah. Then I went. Here's a real pity one. <laughs> oh, God. I made her watch it. <laughs> we all float down here, Iris. <laughs> oh, Georgie. Georgie. Yeah, she knows who Georgie oh, is. Georgie Georgie's just Georgie. like the balloon kid because it's always him in the coat. Just yeah. Like, she yeah. straight up asked me to make her a boat, and I was like, I'm not gonna make you a little toy boat. So yeah. You float it down our Will sidewalk. We make her the boat, and then the you tell her not to drop it. <laughs> no. Mm -mm. Keep an eye out for I'm that. Not doing that. Well. Georgie was told not to lose the boat. Yo, Georgie. Don't hey, yeah. lose the boat. Georgie, the other stuff. I'll tell you this. Georgie got oofed. Yeah. <laughs> got yeah oofed. I learned the word oofed from her. From you didn't know that? Before. No, no, I didn't know that. Wait, well, does Matt know what that I mean, is or no? What? I, I said it it's like, again. Hold on. Imagine. Does Matt know what oofed is? Hang on. So you get killed, right? Right. Okay, cool. Yeah. 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 Well, I don't know if it came from Roblox, but when you die in Roblox, they go, the one that knows the sound. Her black. Yeah. Ooh, I just think know. about like Mike. Like I, I don't know. Yeah. I, I think they cool. popularized yeah. it. So yeah. People. So it's very. It's just an easy like kid friendly way because a lot of the Roblox videos are just like kid friendly and they go I got oofed I got oofed instead of like I'm dead I died I'm killed. They just Which go, is such a oofed. weird rule. And if you it's not a rule, it, but like, like I don't know. I don't know. And so she just started saying it, and so like 
you know, I'll come here and I'll be like, bro, I got oofed. And everyone goes, what the hell are you talking about? What does that even mean? <laughs> Hurt like, and then so at the end of the day, I go, yeah, I got oofed. And Joe's like, oh, Roblox? <laughs> there you go. I went, young blood. <laughs> <laughs> You didn't do Roblox Squid Game with us, right? I don't think you were there for that. Mm -mm. Yeah, that no. was a fun one. Though. I played Crab. Well, that was yeah. that's fun. Crab Game yeah. is Crab game <laughs> so <laughs> stupid. It's so it stupid, is. but it's so fun. It's also really funny too because I heard the word Crab Game a million times before we played it, and I thought it was crabs. Because, <laughs> because to be fair, you might think that's foolish. We also, for about a solid year, one point, kept talking about doing Crab Week, like when Shark Week yeah. was popular. Yeah. We're like, we're gonna do Crab Week. And try and find games that have crabs in them. We found like three. We found like three. <laughs> and then, so then, after that, someone goes, crab game is coming out. I was like, back to crab. <laughs> oh, oh, this is a squid game thing. Yeah. Oh, I didn't get it. Okay. That's fun, though. It's, it is. It's good. I mean, it's just stupid because it's, it's very, like, it's very stupid. Everyone looks are. dumb, too. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, well, they, they added customization. Was I Dude, Oh, really? The last, I thought you were in there when we did it. Oh, did I, I wasn't I in the second Let's Play you did. You guys, we did a stream for the first time, and I was in that one. But I think the second revisit, I was gone. Yeah, I can't I can't remember. I just know that, like, at the end of, like, oh, every fourth stopped. match, you get, like, a customization item to put oh, cool. on. So, yeah. Nice. Wake me up in 2022. Well, when George Jetson's alive? It'd be a, it would be a little extreme. It's August. August. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's coming. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know that. It's going to be a little bit. <laughs> Matt. How much money would it more? take for you me another to say, yeah, to um, That's we, not need, good. <laughs> we need you to donate part of yourself to uh -huh. a surrogate so that we can make George Jetson. You don't have to take care I of this would, child. You don't have wait, to raise I them. I would gladly be what? the father wait, of George okay. Jetson. Hang on. What, what? How so, is this happening? Canonically, George Jetson was born August something in 20, so. 2022. Oh, was he so, really? Yeah. That's yeah. when that show took place? Bro, so, we're behind. Well, yeah. <laughs> Not when it took place. That's when George Jetson was born. Born. So it's even further in the so, future. Oh, he's right. like, what, like 40? Somewhere Well, right then there. again, like, as yeah. a kid, what he was, was an old man? He was probably 23. Yeah, right? Like, George Jetson's <laughs> 20 years old. Gross. This guy's old. <laughs> Let's see. But yeah, um, so the future. Yeah. August 22nd? 22nd. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. so the internet's all preparing for the future of George Jetson and his arrival. We're welcoming our overlord to bring us into the Jetson. Our, I'm going to tell you, did he you watch the show? The yeah, he was kind of the... Uh, <laughs> Like, kind of a schmuck. Yeah. Right? yeah. Kind of like getting bossed around yeah. by a real little guy. A little bit. What was this, Elroy? Was this well, Elroy was his son. Elroy was his son. Was uh, was his son boss, but my it was boy like, Elroy. Well, I don't, because there was, was, there was Stanley thing, Sprockets, yeah. but it's, then there was like, I think, that, I think that was, well, that was the competitor. Oh, gotcha. So I think he worked for Spacely. Uh, he was small. I think the other guy was like the bigger, bald guy. I think. Mm -hmm. S Sprockets. It was all about it's Judy like Sprockets and Gizmos <laughs> or something. Isn't it crazy mm -hmm. how we thought by this year we would have flying cars? I mean, mm -hmm. I mean, I well, also I, I was on to it. <laughs> I <laughs> threw the briefcase in the ground, became the car. And I was like, on to it a couple of years ago. I went. I don't think it's gonna happen. It was. <laughs> I I I don't know when reality set in. Right. I think the '80s people were like, man, who knows? And then 2005, people went. Mm, I don't yeah. think so. I don't we're, know. We're I don't can you make my phone the, bigger? Like the main robot. <laughs> can you, yeah. Yeah, the only thing can that you... we've advanced is how big your fucking thing is. Right. Yeah. Dude, <laughs> dude, I'll be honest. Besides flying cars, too, though, you look at stuff like the Jetsons, and it's like, yo, all that shit sucks compared to a phone, though. Like, phone's way better. That has you a know what I mean? Though. Like, I would take the phone now than, like, again, like, my briefcase has a uh, coat rack in it. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. It's like it's like 70s yeah. stuff that's yeah. futuristic. Yeah. Like, you if know, it doesn't like, have an Iron Man suit in it, I don't care. <laughs> yeah. When, yeah. I, don't when I walk in, my robot takes my hat and coat and puts it on the coat rack that doesn't exist anymore. We haven't done that yet. Matt has a point, though. We're sure, we're on course. the way to Rosie. We're at the Roomba level. Mm -hmm. We're on Roomba right now. Gotta gotta we're way we're past up. Roomba. I'm just gonna, we've had Roomba. Oh my yeah. god. Now we have robot, like, robot dogs. Uh, Nicholas is. We've had day. those since the nineties. Yeah, come on, that's true. But they, they just better. they bark and then they fall over and then you. Y'all ever one for good. Those robot dogs were the worst. What? They were. I know. They seem so cool. They always look. And I remember. I think like. Furbies were Every better. Year, right? I got a, I got a different better. shitty one. Well, because and the it Furby was shitty for different reasons. I like, think the Furby lowered the expectation because it's just this thing. A Furby. dog was like, "That's a dog. That's a robot." And then you're like, "This dog sucks." Yeah, was it Jimmy yeah. Neutron that threw you off? Kind of Jimmy Neutron what? really did make you feel like it was possible, but right. that thing didn't have like robot legs. It had like tubes that moved around. Yeah, oh, and God. like jet propulsion. Yeah, yeah. yeah, he was also essentially a bike. That's interesting too, because nuts and bolts for some reason. But you wanted, but 
<laughs> recharged it. What, what was he eating them for? You wanted that one. I watched Jimmy Neutron. You I like just, I just went, man, I want to have a Carl one day. I just oh, my Carl. Carl. Yeah. yeah. Jimmy. yeah. It's like, this is my Carl. Jimmy. Yeah. Yeah. You do a great impression of Carl and Trevor. I want you and Trevor to have a Carl off. Oh, yeah. Who's this kid? I made it. That's Carl. Oh, I would are. like a third competitor to be Carl from Aqua Teen Hunger Force. Oh, dude, that'd be awesome. Oh, <laughs> That's Jeremy as Carl. Yeah. Hey, yeah. new movie coming out. <laughs> are they really? Really? Yeah, they're making three new Adult Swim movies. Bless you. Oh, what? They're doing cool. what? Another Aqua Teen, uh, Venture Brothers. Oh, I can't wait for one? Aqua Teen. That's awesome. Yeah, that's awesome. Third awesome. Hunger Force. Anyone Ooh. know? Tyler. Tyler, Tyler what is on, it? On Venture Brothers. What's the third Adult Swim movie? They're doing Aqua Teen, uh, Venture Brothers, and something else. Is it Birdman? I don't remember. Squid Bill. That'd be awesome. Too. No, it's so weird. weird. Yeah. Squid Bill is a weird. That's a choice. Yeah. But I'm there. Just, All right. Are you just <laughs> robot chicken? What is it? Metal Oh, what? That's I, awesome. I just That's like before. Cool. I think before you got the robot chicken, you just kept whispering chicken. No, chicken. No. I was saying robot chicken. 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 Oh, yeah. Metal Lock. <laughs> Metal Lock Lips is a show I think I would like. I just never got into it <laughs> when it was out. Uh, the Metal the bits and pieces I watched, I liked a lot. Yeah. The, to me, the entire show is just their manager. Interview. Well, I think I think I was too young to get it when it was out that it was like, mm -hmm. oh, this is like a metal band. I don't like that, and not it's like a spoof, a play on that. It's like a parody. Yeah. You know, what I mean? it's about all, me. it's about everything that's not the metal band. Yeah. And I'm sure yeah. now I would love that because yeah. it's just so stupid. Um, Aqu Aquatine Hunger Force was just like, oh, this is weird because look at it. And then also it took place in New Jersey. And also, I knew a million people like Carl. And I was like, this rules. You're like, is this a, is this a documentary? This or fucking show rules. <laughs> you like, look out the window, you right, see a big right surprise. Like, That's this accurate. might be right. That's accurate. <laughs> it's, just, it's just like any given episode, but Carl hiding behind his house. And Frylock Lane Green's doorbell going, go away. Go away. Go away, you freaking freak. freak. I love that clip go, so much. Go away, you freak. Go, My favorite Aqua Teen clip. Can I not live here for one minute? In peace, <laughs> without dealing with you animals. <laughs> My favorite Aqua Teen clip, which I resonate yeah. with so much, is when Meat Lock gets <laughs> the adult glass and like Frylock brings over the up. Yeah, he's like, no, don't you give me that slipper cup. I'm an adult and I deserve an adult glass. And he immediately knocks it over. He goes and like this, yeah. knocks it over. It's chocolate milk yes. gets spoiled. That, yeah. was, that was when he can see the beauty. Yeah. Meat Lock's my favorite character. From it's a great character, yeah. I just, I think my favorite thing about that show is Master Shake. Anything that left contact with his hands exploded. Exploded. Yeah. And, well, again, they had and this. So one well, they, well, they also they not only, it at all. They did the explosion and they also did the fire where they just yeah. had a real video mm -hmm. of fire. <laughs> and they would just reuse the same thing <laughs> constantly in the animation. It would just like the carpet would be on fire, but it would be a real fire. They use that constantly. Well, the only time we saw that after Aqua Teen, which maybe you guys want to watch it, it's not, it's a family friendly show, um, but it's Cupcake and Dino. And they do the same thing where like someone will discard something actually, and will blow up. No, it, was really fun. Yeah. Watch Cupcake and it was on it's, Netflix. I watched it again because our kid was like one when it came mm -hmm. out. Mm -hmm. And I was just like, this is really funny. Like, yeah. I, don't, I, I don't know who it's for. I think it's probably more for like, Parents, adolescents, or teenagers, and like children. Mm. Um, but it's very funny. Yeah. It actually has like humor for adults. The guy who plays Dino is Mark Little, and you guys might know him from. Um, do you remember uh, like Picnic Face Productions? They did Super Bingo and Power Thirst back in the day. Drink Power Thirst. The yeah. electrolytes, oh, more lights than your body can handle. Movie. Yeah, what's that guy? So his comedy group went on to make Cupcake and Dino. So if you like some of those like weird, non sequitur jokes. There, there's some of those in there. But yeah, it's enjoyable for sure. Check it out. Also, wasn't Brendan Small the one who produced Metalocalypse? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which is also Yeah, great. he did he did that. He's, he did home he's movies. A, home movies. Yep. He's Nathan he Explosion. Something else. Yeah. Oh really? Yeah. Huh. Nice. That's also I think of um <clears throat> Said someone stopped me a long time ago. So yeah, thank you. Good, thank you for being respectful. That was a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want anymore. Did you watch Super Jail Joe? I know exactly that's what I said. No, um, I left. Oh. That's Darn. also, I think, the. I, like, I remember being, like, on the inside of I knowing who uh, H. John Benjamin was before he was, like, hugely famous. And it's from, you know, um, home movies. Brendan. Yeah. Because Brendan he played, well, he played Coach, Coach and, and Jason. Yeah. He played his friend Jason, too. And yeah. I was just like, this guy, this guy rules. It was like a class, he was like a classic, like, sunny character. He was just like this... Just He's piece like of shit. shit. Just like piece yeah. of shit. He always someone had a life soft, lesson for Brandon, coach. but it always tied into like him being in jail or how his wife left him. Yeah. <laughs> like, I remember. I like remember. Too, was like, too, dude, like, yeah. he had so yes. much stuff, and he'd just be it's talking so to, he'd be talking amazing. to Brandon like, Brandon here, can you go give me, go give me, go give me coffee? Like, should I just go in the middle of the day? I just go. Come here. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Catch the ball! <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> so, like, scream at the game, like, intermittently. And then uh, I remember one episode. Do that, Coach McGurk. One episode. Oh, really he was tired. Doing, Shut up, he was doing stand up. He kept doing, doing stand up. He kept doing stand up. And it was like, I think it was like the button at the end of the episode, but he's just like doing stand up and it's awful. And, and someone's like, boo. And he's like, oh, we got a heckler. We got a heckler. And he goes, he goes, oh, thanks for. Oh, thanks for coming out to my show, Mom. Really appreciate it. <laughs> she said something. She said, 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 he was like, oh, I have another drink. And, she, and she's like, I should. You were drinking from your father's bottle since you were two. And he goes, oh, my God, it is my mom. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Similar vein of content. Did y'all ever watch Super Jail? Super Jail fans or no? Uh, that show was too yeah. weird for me it, when I it, when it was on. There's a line. It, exactly. Yeah, there it, was was like, it rode that like Ren and Stimpy line of just so gross. So gore weird. For yeah, no that reason. That was like I yeah. could yeah. I tried but just couldn't. I just it it, it, not that this did it, but it's in the realm of it. I can do like gross and weird and gore. I can't do like booger humor, right? Something where it's just like so just disgust. Squidbillies had a lot of that yep. too, Squid right? Yeah. Where it's yeah. just like again, Aqua Teen was more weird in the show, and there's some episodes where I go, "This, is, this is too much for me." This yeah. too much. Like when they did like the Condom Man episode, <laughs> I was like, "This, yeah. this is getting too, this is getting too gross. This is getting too gross." Uh, Ren and Snappy was like that. It was always like a close up on their nostril, yeah, yeah. and there'd be like slimy Which boogers SpongeBob coming does that out too. But I'm okay with it uh, for some reason. Well, because that, it's understood. They're my scene. brain, that's super yeah. scale. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. very nice. People like it's licking. Be better words. Any kind of licking right? going on. Nope. nope. <laughs> it's, no, it's not, I don't know. Yeah, no, I agree. There's a few jokes in Super Jail that really landed for me. Like the time police are fantastic. But yeah, um, I find most people that talk about like adult swim humor, they have that line exactly. They're like, oh, Super Jail's too much. Like that's where I got to stop. Mm -hmm. So I don't know what your line is of well, content. Well, it's like right there. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, again, like yeah. I like, I think like my line's like somewhere within there. I think right? a like, lot it ebbs and weaves. Mine's like it's, it's particular, You're amoebic. right? Because yeah. some people go, "That's too graphic." I, I don't have like a graphic. It's just like ah, that's like booger stuff. It's just like <laughs> I, I can't explain it. You know what I mean? I don't want to see people dripping boogers and eating. It's not them funny. Yeah. It's not funny. Just but it's when I go. You want to yeah. see people saved by boogers? Oh, it's a, but the <laughs> thing is, like, it's a similar level. I know some people. It's like oh, I can't watch it. It's too gory, right? Like their heads yeah. explode or yeah. whatever. I love that, right? Like, like whatever. Like the boys on yeah. Amazon. Where it's just so overtly, like absurdly so many bloody and yeah. gory. Yeah. I love it. I love that the first stuff. episode. Yeah. yeah. I Red and Stimpy to me is a classic. Like I know people love it, and I just go, ah, "This can do it." What's or like it? again, they they really do that in SpongeBob, where it's like they do the hyper realistic punch in. Yeah. You see all like the wrinkles and yeah. like and like. Yeah. The, or another one would be like crud in their eye, yeah. and yeah. scooping it out. Yeah. It's like, well, oh, it's yeah. too much. Now, what's interesting from it's my perspective is I have that same exact mentality of like, I don't want too much. I like gore, especially like anime gore, I think is a little mm -hmm. different. And sometimes it's like, oh, that was really hardcore. Like, cool. Someone just died in a really horrific way. Awesome. Mm -hmm. I'm into it. Um, but I felt that way about Invincible, and people love Invincible, but I'm like, I felt like it was just another like gore fest, and I was really oh, dumb is. with like this. I mean, well, the thing, thing plot. Well, I let me say know. this about Invincible. Like, it is. That that really only had one huge like moment. If you haven't watched it, Invincible on on uh, I think it's on Amazon mm -hmm. is because if you didn't know any of the like what the show was, like the comic or the graphic novel or whatever, mm -hmm. the entire first episode doesn't have it at all. It's very much like oh, this is like um like a Justice League spoof, oh, right? You know what yeah. I mean? Like like not even parody. It's like this this is the Justice League. It's like you got the fast guy, the super strong guy, this, that, whatever. The and you're just kind of like watching it like th there's nothing, I'd say nothing original, but there's no like hook beyond like, okay, how is this different than the Justice League without like the IP, really, yeah. right? It's just yeah. like, well, that's the Batman guy. That's the stretchy guy. There's nothing. And you're just watching it going like, oh, okay. And there's like, they catch the bad guy, and then, you know, all you really get is, like, oh, there's this, like, Superman guy, and it's his son, right? And that's, like, oh, I guess that's the story. And then the last, like, two minutes, it's, like, oh, and also, though, here's the Walking Dead part that you were kind of going, oh, because oh, it's Robert Kirkman. And so yeah. you're going, are they going to Walking Dead this? And the whole first episode, because I didn't know anything about it, I went, oh, I guess they're not. And then you get to the last, like, five minutes, and you go, nope, there it is. And then the rest of the show is, like, See, I've never watched that. It's really yeah, that I, first I episode is, either. like, mm -hmm. But it, but you can't you can't do it again, right? You yeah. can't be shocked after that moment right. and go, 
Oh. And that's what I felt it was. It oh was shock God. value. People get literally like ripped right. in half. Like right? I watched yeah. the Harley from like Quinn we caught interview. the bad guy. He's going to jail, and then whoosh, and like their brains fall out, and you go, "Holy <laughs> shit!" Sure. That's when I went. This show rules. <laughs> <laughs> like, again, for me, I didn't loved grab it. on that. That shit happens and stuff like the animated Harley Quinn show, and I yeah. love it. Like injected into that my veins. Show's very I funny. love yeah. it. It's so good. <laughs> I like the only time that Michael might like booger. Booger humor is uh-huh. Spider-Man booger humor. Ooh, maybe. Yeah. Well, I mean, even then, but like, you can talk about it. I just don't want you to see it and, like, Well, what, like, if, you saw, what if you saw Miles Morales, like, sneeze and then he... <sighs> see, but the thing is, again, it's like... Like, it turns into webbing, like, from... The thing, from the the again, again, again... Spider-Man, it's a hand. But then I, I could get it, because it'd be like, oh, that's weird. He saved this guy with boogers. If Miles Morales went, oh, look at my boogers, and then ate them, it would be different. But then... You know, know what I mean? Well, you know what I mean? Or like, and then he like spit it's, it's like he, he had like pockets of them around the. The, city. the thing like, is, again, if you go, if you go, they're boogers, but it looks exactly <laughs> like a web. It's gonna yeah. bother me. It's, it's, it's when gaming. it's when they go, we're gonna use boogers, and it's gonna be fucking disgusting. Oh. Yeah, like and Ren and Stimpy. Has. It's, it's oh, just oh, I can't oh, describe yeah. it more than yeah. Ren and Stimpy. Imagine Ren and Stimpy is just the perfect. Always, just like God, it's so gross. It's just such a disgusting. I guess a live action equivalent. Or like when they lick their fur, you know, like cats. It's like, and it's like super. Slow and they'll have like oh, yeah. their tongues are like yeah, sandpaper. It's like ripping now, hair off, and I'm just going, oh my. That's just ridiculous. Oh, I own cats. Oh my That's god. Yes. I, yeah, but it's just I, I have a that cat. I've out. never. Watched I, I know like, what they're doing. In pain, like lick herself. <laughs> just like I know what She's we're doing, Matt, and what we're doing right now is going to the ads. Unless you're a first member, then you won't watch them. This episode of Off Topic is also brought to you, or maybe this one's first. And the next one is also, but right now, we're talking about HelloFresh, okay? This is HelloFresh time. This is tasty, tasty time, tasty tummy time. That's what I call it. I say, tasty tummy time is here. And Lindsay says, please stop that. It's HelloFresh. Uh, that's fine. The new year is here. And it's time to start working on those resolutions of yours. Want to save some money by ordering less takeout? Want to learn to cook? Or maybe prioritize your wellness? Well, guess what? You can do it all with HelloFresh, okay? And gives you endless options to make cooking at home fun and easy. HelloFresh delivers pre-portioned ingredients straight to your door so you can skip the trip to the grocery store and avoid overbuying. Why are you buying? Here, you buy, you buy that food, you don't need two things, right? You're gonna waste it, which is a waste of money. It's a waste of food. Or you're gonna overeat. You don't need to do that. Don't punish yourself, okay? Plus, their farm fresh produce arrives within a week so you get all the conveniences without skipping on quality. HelloFresh meals are ready in 30 minutes or less with plenty of other fast, low prep, and easy cleanup options to fit into your hectic schedule. Because don't forget, you got to clean it up too, right? That's important. That's good. Wow, this took five minutes to make and two hours to clean up. Not HelloFresh though, okay? What's not to like? It's simple. It's easy. It's delicious. It's cheaper than the grocery store in a lot of instances. It comes right to your door. You make it, you eat it. It's all good. Go to HelloFresh.com slash off topic 16 and use code off topic 16 for up to 16 free meals and three free gifts. They're now up to 16 meals. They're just, I mean, chow down, go nuts. Okay. That's hellofresh.com slash off topic 16 and code off topic 16 for up to 16 free meals and three free gifts. HelloFresh, America's number one meal kit. This episode of off topic, the show that you're watching is brought to you by MeUndies. MeUndies is back with their ultimate gift guide so you can save time and focus on going home for the holidays and winning the holidays with the coziest gifts ever. Or you don't go home, you do whatever you want, you buy them for yourself. That also works too, okay? You've heard heard me talk about MeUndies. I'm I'm always doing undie talk, okay? Myundi this, Myundi that. I'm not saying Myundi's fast. I'm Myundi's. Uh, but they're great. They're soft. They got undies. They got loungewear. They got all kinds of stuff. And it's all great. Their uh, onesie pajama thing I have. It's very nice. It's very nice. And you know what? It's time to get festive with the new Myundi's holiday collection featuring classic plaids you know and love and sweater inspired prints that'll quickly become your favorites. Their undies, loungewear, and sleepwear are made out of unbelievably soft, breathable, stretchy fabrics that are ideal for sitting fireside with loved ones and enjoying a delicious cup of hot cocoa. That you have to buy yourself though. That doesn't, <clears throat> doesn't come with 
the clothes. Get the family photo you've always dreamed of with matching PJ sets or make every day a spa day with the new plush robes and plush slippers. I'm, I'm going to get a pair of those slippers. I'm in the slipper market right now. Um, I'm going to lock it in. Whatever you choose, everyone will be rolling into the new year comfier than ever. Available in sizes XS through 4XL, MeUndies has a little something-something for everyone on your list. MeUndies has a great offer for you, our viewers, our listeners. Her, um, I don't know, what, I'm, what, I'm, what do I call them, Tyler? Our, uh, <sighs> no, something cool like, uh. Or pals. How's that? Pals? Yeah. Make sure leave all that in. For our pals, very natural. 15% off any first-time purchasers and free shipping right to your door. Classic pal move. Your days of fighting for your life in the mall parking lot are over. To get 15% off your first order, free shipping, and a 100% satisfaction guarantee plus lock in that, Pal title, go to MeUndies.com slash off topic. That's MeUndies.com slash off topic. Happy holidays. But even if you weren't a first member, they already ended now. Oh my God. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. That was quick. You see, it was very, was I, I talked very fast. Yeah. Wow. You, you did it, dude. Mm -hmm. Matt well made done. a face when I suggested that the equivalent of gross animated humor. I got it, Tyler. In Tim and Eric. <laughs> some of it lands for me. Some of it is kind of a little unnecessary gross. I, I mean, I think. I'm not like a huge fan of Tim and Eric. Yeah, like, I mean, like I'll go to that. I, I think they sometimes. definitely have like a lot of good, good stuff. But yeah, like the the show, I just didn't really watch. Hmm. But I don't think it was as gross. I just think of it as like maybe I didn't get it at the time. Yeah, there's there's know. a lot you got to yeah. get, and that that show really goes for it too, right? So mm -hmm. it's either like, oh, this is funny, or the thing with uh, Tim and Eric too, like just in that style, is like they'll do something and you go, oh, I don't like I don't find this funny, yeah. and it's six minutes long. Mm -hmm. Right. That's so, the thing. so then you're just like. I hate this, right? <laughs> if you like it, it's amazing. Yeah. But if you go, oh, I know the bit, I don't like it. And that's like, well, that was 30% like of the episode. The show. Yeah. Right? Or, or more, yeah, I mean, like a 15 minute. That show, Tom Goes to the Mayor, was so weird. Which it was, was. Like, I think that came out before Tim and Eric, I, like I, the I, live action show, which yeah. was just Tim and Eric. And like, I watched a lot of it, I think, just because it was on. And I'm like, right. I'll, I'll give I it a I used to watch I, everything because it was on Adult Swim, because when it came out, there was four shows. Yeah. It's like, now there's six shows. We still watch them. Then they got into like really weird live action stuff. A Tim right? and Eric sketch oh, yeah, is. They did. They remember like they the remember they did that like, with, like dude even then that was like later. I remember one of the first shows that they remember that weird ass mole man show. It was like I was just like what? A... what? This what? is what? Adult what? Swim. Does anybody Tyler remember that? Mole remember that man. mole show? And Drinky Crow. It was a guy. It was a live action show, and the guy was like, "I I live underground," and I was just like, "What is happening?" I thought. What? Oh, man. I can't yeah. remember what it was called. You're yeah. playing Roblox. It was Roblox. <laughs> I'll look it up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, then they started doing a lot of live action stuff. Weird. I like when Adult Swim started doing like anime, like Amy Asha and stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. dude. The, the, that was, well, that was, that was the Toonami, like the whole block. I always yeah. say Toonami is like the gateway drug for all the otakus in my life. It was. Including myself. That's how I got into a lot of it. I was like, it. holy yeah. fuck, what's this? Anime? And I wasn't allowed to watch like Simpsons, South Park, like nada in my house until like, yeah, I graduated. Yeah, I can yeah, I can either. But anime was the loophole. My parents went, oh, it's a cartoon. It's from Japan. Seems cool. And meanwhile, it's like... Saul of the Moment. Yeah, like Elf and Lied playing, me, so... I got I, to watch that anime. sounds familiar. Yeah, yeah, I got to watch anime because my mom's whole family... I remember that. This is... Uh, this oh, is my stuff, God. So God. Like, yeah, I know what this is. This that's awesome. Show. Nice. <laughs> what Just the look fuck? at it and go, yep, that's, that's, that's the right. show. Let me see. Let me see. Imagine right. that, but 15 minutes. Is it pretty accurate? I Yeah, I... I don't know where the phone is. I did have a yeah, yeah, yeah. and yeah. the album of that. Yeah, yeah. Mold. Well, yeah. we can get you the album. That was what year was this? Two thousand and seven. Did you watch any Hush on Tsunami? You yes. didn't. No, you did. Okay, wow. I'm shocked. Where I do you know, think? All this time. What do you think I watched? What are you talking? I don't know. What are you talking about? <laughs> I I never I, knew you to be a huge Inuyasha fan. You've seen it, but never been a huge fanboy. Don't even get me started. We've had the discussion say, about whether or not say, you only should have gotten Inuyasha at the end or not, but still. <laughs> I say we. Not even we, I, and then you were kind of there. Like, I, I rewatched it, like, two years ago. Like, the whole, oh, yeah, no, the whole show. <laughs> I just went, like, entirely. strolling through whatever streaming service. And Ian Yashi was there. I went, oh, fuck it. I just started. It's just a cat. Man. It was a dog, man. It's not a cat. Yeah, he's yeah, a, a, a dog. dog. He's like a wolf. He's a dog, he's for sure. No, I would say he's a dog because Koga's a wolf. And he got the original cat boy. Yeah, he's the original I ain't looking to start shit. 
but he's a dog. And then well, she, she are you team Koga or team Inuyasha? That's the question, really. Well, you know? Inuyasha, Koga sucks. Well, no, that was a thing. Qualities, but, no, I, yeah. no, it certainly was. That was that was pre Twilight. They both bro. suck. You, you, you all <laughs> they, lose. They team, <laughs> team Edward. Yeah, but or like Jacob. Oh, yeah, there we um, go. Team Human Kid who wanted to yeah. take Bella to prom. Yeah. That guy. Or Team Vampire. <laughs> or Team Vampire guy who Remember just him? in the sun. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm Team. Let's have a war and then and then build up to it and then not have it. I should have yeah. had the war. And then we go. That would have been cool. Never mind. I think they. In the book, in the movie, no, oh no, no, in the movie they kind of had it. In the movie they kind of had it. The book, I remember. So I saw the first three Twilight movies because why not, right? And Mm -hmm. then when they announced, I never read the books, and then I loved it. I loved just like I know what Twilight is. And then they announced the last book would be two, or the last movie was going to be two parts. They went, Harry Potter did it. We're going to do it too. And I went, Oh, time for this. And so I just said, fuck it. And I just read the last book. So I saw the first three movies and I read the last book. And I'm just like, I think I'm reading it and I'm reading it. And the whole, like almost the whole book is about, they're like, we're going to war with, I can't remember what they're called. The, the, the something. It was a V. The, they're like, they're like the, 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 yeah, they're like yeah. the royal vampires. It's like, you're not allowed to make half human, half vampire babies. We're going to war. And so they fight a little bit, like they argue a little bit, Isn't it like and then they go. Ten people. We're going. <laughs> we're going to war. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, but yeah, but they're, like, yeah, but they're like super duper strong. Yeah, like a million I know, times but... stronger than them, right? And so, so like straight up, most of the book, besides Jacob's shit and being like, oh, I gotta kill you, I'll kill you, I love you, I'll kill you," <laughs> which is basically his whole thing. It's just them being like, "We gotta recruit people." The the fourth book of Twilight is the is the plot of Sakodin, where it's like. The 108 stars of destiny, gotta get them. And it's just them going around going, you're gonna fight the Voltorian? And like, we're gonna do it. That's the whole book. <laughs> then they get to the very end and they get to do the battle and then someone makes a shield and then one person dies and they go, you don't have to Stop fight, it. man. And they don't. <laughs> I just remember going, what? I just remember reading it going, wait, <laughs> what? They didn't fight? And they're like, Peace. We've yeah. come to terms We've with this. Come. We figured it We're out. out of here. And then, and then to follow up on that, they go, "Hey, you know that cursed life of your weird freak child that you had? <laughs> Guess <laughs> what? She's gonna age super you rapidly. It's Renesme. It's Renesme. Come on now. They're gonna. She's gonna age super rapidly, only to eighteen, and then pff, stop. She's gonna look ugly as hell. Well, not like that. But now it's like it's not weird because she's like got the brain of an adult. But she'll never get older, and you can be like a chill ass family. <laughs> You're like, you know, tw- in your 20s, she's 18. It's not weird that Jacob is like, I'm, oh, it wasn't Bella. It was your baby. I loved her since she go, was a fetus. And you go, hold on. It's like, oh, I thought, <coughs> yeah, you don't remember that? No. no he kept no, saying, no, I love no, Bella, I love just... Bella. And then it's like, oh my God, I love the baby she was going to have. You're like, whoop, it's the whoop, baby. Whoop, right here, officer. And you go, what? <laughs> he imprinted. Yeah. That's right, bro. And he was like, it's all, bro, it's all good. I'm not going to kill anybody. Vampires are chilly shit. Everybody's like high fiving. No opposable thumbs. Jacob and Edward are like, oh. He's like, you're you're dating my (laughs) five-year-old daughter. And he's like, yeah, but she's like 20, though. He's like, true that. And she'll be 20 forever. And then they all ran through the forest at super speed. And that (laughs) that was the book. And I went, well, I know everything. (laughs) So you mentioned anime earlier. Yeah. Oh, every <laughs> there is a good segue here. Because That's it. A lot of animes I love do the same kind of bullshit where it's like, don't. There's this word. girl who looks like she's a child. And they're like, oh, but it's cool. She's like three thousand year old. I'm like, million. that's still fucking weird. Yeah. Nope. That, have a problem with that. Well, and that comes <laughs> little nope. bit This is the opposite situation of. where yeah. like this, same shit the different toilet. Yeah. 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 Oh yeah. Right. So mm-hmm. it's like it goes like straight to that. But it's still really fucking. Have weird. you watched Dude, Seven Deadly it, Sins or no? Yes, yeah, Seven okay. Deadly Sins is Dude. like. I'm not gonna lie, it was pretty good. It's enjoyable, but I go. But yeah. Just come on. But I mean, basically, it's like this ten year old boy. I'll be on. Oh, dude, no. it's all over. And not, not only that. that. And yeah. then, no, it's, it's, all, it's all over the place, Bond. man. It's all over the yeah. place. All, real talk, I'm going to get really passionate because Bond was like my husband, though. I was like, I love this man. He's amazing. I love his character. Phenomenal. And then that 
happened but the thing is that too, it's moment, like, I was bro, like, bro, on paper, Fuck this. it all works. No. It's on paper. Like, and it's like, why are you going to draw him like that? What are you doing? Come on. <laughs> no. Come on. I know you're 10,000 years old. Come I've, on. I've never stood you know up I mean? and turned off the television, I just, but I did in that moment. It's just like, like come on. Nope. Yeah. You know? And then uh, it's like, dude, that, that, that was like, no. Yeah. When that came in the, my, uh, my hero with Gentle Criminal. Oh, see, I haven't I no, actually seen yet. Yet. I stopped yeah. and looked it up and went, what's going on here? <laughs> because it's just like there's this very weird, like, I'm, I like tea. It's basically like the guy's like, I'm, I'm like a, I'm a, a smooth criminal. And the guy's like, he's, he, he like, literally wants to be like YouTube famous. But for doing like silly crime, you know what I mean? It's not violent or anything. Silly. And his and his 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 power is literally like he can create, like oh, yeah. um, basically like essentially like like rubber or or like r like bouncing. Imagine like an invisible trampoline. Like that's what he can do. Oh, okay. Someone gets thrown and they go boing, 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 and he can just like do it to shit. And so his like name is Gentle, right? Because it's like, but the, he can like touch a steel beam, turn it into rubber. But then turn it back, like, so then, like, the steel beam falls, right? He's and so he's got a little cohort. It's very Joker and Harley, Harley Quinn, Quinn. Yeah. But, like... Which the, makes it even weirder. But the girl is go ahead. a foot and a half tall, <laughs> and you're watching it, and the guy's, like, gray hair and everything, and you're going... And I got about two episodes in, and I went... I try not to look shit up, because especially with anime, where the manga's further, yeah. you can type someone's name in, and the result is dead yeah. when they die. And you yeah. go, God damn it. What volume. Right, exactly. What, what, what but I look it up, and it's like, the man who looks to be in his 40s or 50s, he's like 32, and the girl who is, I, I get, I, she doesn't look like a child, but she's like two feet tall. She's like 25. And I was like, what? <laughs> What are, you, what are you doing? <laughs> what is this? Why? <laughs> Make him shorter. Make her taller. Yep. That. Look, that's them right there. Yeah. They're like less than 10 years apart. And she's in her 20s. And, even, and he's like 30. Doesn't make any sense. It's weird. Yeah. Oh. It's, maybe, it's, <laughs> maybe it's a stylistic choice. Hmm. You know, uh, I mean, I, it is what, a no, choice. No, I mean, her her, her face goes to his knee. It's the yeah. thought yeah. that counts. And even her right? pal. Dude, oh. her, her quirk is like, whoever I love gets stronger. And so she's like, I love you, gentle. And he's like, I'm super powerful for 10 minutes. And I'm just going, oh. Why? Why did you do this? <laughs> Go back to the school. That too. Go back to Deku. Can no, we go? Can, can we go back to Bakugo yelling at everyone? <laughs> why? Why was this yeah, necessary? I'm, yeah, I'm, yeah <laughs> think about that. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Huh. Again, you read it. If you read it, and you were like, "Oh yeah, it's a new guy. He's like his power in the third and yeah, yeah, yeah." Why did you do that? Why would you? Why would you draw that? I don't understand it. <laughs> Puts a really weird image in my head. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's just, just some questions I have, some yeah. concerns. Yeah. And like I've read on anime specifically. I'm like, it's across the board in a lot of media. Yeah. I mean, like, we could go back into like books that were written in the 1800s or like, this is problematic and concerning. But the biggest thing I point to now and think about is like growing up, I love the labyrinth a lot. I still oh, love it. Oh, see. Yeah. Destiny. That's her favorite. It's a fantastic film. Oh. I just like and think about how much of the takeaway from it was David Bowie is sexy. Instead of, excuse me, this guy's kind of creepy to this high school girl. Let's let's discuss this for one moment real quick it's like very romantic and overtly sexual and he stole her brother okay anyways i don't know what elaborate can i tell you, i've never seen that movie <laughs> yeah, really see, i'm not gonna lie i haven't either but it's like that's his favorite how'd you get away with that though then? yeah that's how is your favorite you've never seen it I just, I just, like, does she know i'm not watching it. <laughs> <laughs> i'm just I don't saying like, I don't like, I don't usually like, that's like, like that's my favorite movies, like, and they go movies. oh great gotcha. now it's time for you to watch it no no i was like i don't like old movies oh okay what's old like 70s on? Let Fish, him answer. Fish. I'm asking. Please. Yeah. Like 80s, Probably. 70s. Okay. That's just not. I'll go back to about Star Wars and then I'm done. That's it. I can yeah. do mid 60s. So, like, I know people, I I know people who that. like black and white movies. Really? Yeah, I don't and care. I'm like, how? I mean, I, yeah, I could almost I don't, suck. I don't, I I don't like that because it's like, Joe, I don't see the world terrible. like that. You know, like Casablanca? Terrible. Right, no. Casablanca. No. You know what? Yeah. I'm sure Casablanca was point. great when it came oh, out. no. Why would I watch it? If it's that like, came out now, I'd be like, <laughs> yeah. this sucks. Mm. If someone released it in theaters, I'm like, what the fuck am I doing? I'm Why am I going to that? Yeah. Bro, I want to watch Thwip. Yeah. <laughs> if I wanted to watch Spider-Man in here. And then there's people right now screaming at this podcast. Like, 
That's a work of art. And I go, ah, yeah, sucks. I'm, I'm my, sucks. my love of film is like suppressed right now. I'm like, don't look, say I'm just it's saying fine, it's love fine, of film. Yeah, see, that's, I mean, that's I, what I, they I, have. I understand yeah. it, right? I understand people who like movies like that, but it's just not right. for me. Same. I get it. Yeah. So like, Same. I think I think I think Destiny tried to get me to watch Labyrinth one time, and I was like, you just went. Did you know this is old? I was like, mm. so there are Muppets. Hey, I don't know if anybody told there's, you. There's static in the screen. Okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. The movie is fuzzy. Back Joe. when, like, uh, is that, you can feel it. Is that green screen? No, it wasn't invented yet. That's yeah. paint. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my. I'm definitely one of those. It's all what? practical. It's beautiful. Well, like, what do you so. mean? What do you oh, mean it's oh, yeah. paint? Recently, where's the computer? What is it? Like the dark crystal? Dude, that yeah. Netflix one. Uh -huh. That's on, great. On Netflix, I heard yeah. like it doesn't really like that, and I heard great things about it but i just can't get into it because it's just not my type of like show yeah. or movie or whatever so now would you watch a new movie in black and white because i know they've been doing some re-releases to make know, it feel but artsy but the, no they've no, been doing I, that yeah no i i understand that but <laughs> what's how the does appeal that, i don't know i'd People look like, at it and go you 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 didn't plug a wire in yeah yeah, yeah. if i wanted exactly. to look there's at it so, it's so like wrong with this the, plug check fire the, the projection the, the green's <laughs> loose i could just have michael put me on another picture right exactly it's red check make sure the red green you have the there's two reds one's audio one is the other video you're missing a component cable i don't understand <laughs> All right. Hey, we're we're re-releasing it in black and white. Cool. Why? Also, you know, every TV can do that. You could just turn that off and on. You don't need to release the movie oh, yeah. like that. It's and just like, look, now SpongeBob's what? in black and What's white. What's the use of that? Artsy. Yeah. yeah, like, I don't other know. than just, yeah, I wanted to be artsy when watching Spongebob today. Michael, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I, don't I know you rewatched Inuyasha and I missed entirely. Let's go back again. We're yeah. going to oh, rewatch no, Inuyasha in black and white. Okay. <laughs> I just want to see how different it is. <laughs> What's the dumbest shit you could watch in black and white that's colored now? Like, I'd... It had to be like some kind of like Sesame Street. But why? I don't know. But why? But why? <laughs> that, that's like, that's like notoriously I'm like... Think. Like a notoriously known show. Yeah. Ren like and like and imagine and watching Twilight in black and white. Oh my god. It'd be the worst. Well, like they did that thing. But now. like they yeah. did that with The Walking Dead. Like you remember, like multiple oh, yeah. times mm -hmm. where it's yeah. like Walking Dead, blah blah blah, season whatever airing tonight in black and white. And it's went why? It's 2016. And I poured myself a glass of wine. Went, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's lovely. Uh, Someone go uh, drop <laughs> everything. <laughs> Let's see if they can get that. It's in black and white tonight. No 40 minutes. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but arts. I don't. I love it. Like I, I can only, I can only assume that it's there's some sort of nostalgia thing. Like I remember when stuff was like this. You know what mm. I mean? Like again, if you watch the yeah. original Dawn of the Dead or whatever. Yeah. Cool. I don't get it of people who didn't live in that generation. Of yeah, because we were forced to. Do you, right. do you, do you remember choice. when that happened? Uh, in The Walking Dead, where they, they like had that guy in the well for like an yes. entire episode. Carl. I also remember that happening <laughs> in Silence of the Lambs. So, but that, Coral. so I, I watched a thing. Coral. 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 I watched Stop a thing on that that show where like the first season was like six episodes, like over an hour long, almost all of them, and they were very well done. Mm -hmm. And then you realize where AMC was like, we want money though, so like triple the amount of episodes, more faffing about. To keep them to like one location, right. do nothing. Yeah, that's no. the farm. Yeah, the yeah. farm. Yeah. What? And that's like ninety that. percent of season two was in one People, spot. Yeah, it was. It's literally like they were like, mm -hmm. "Oh, that zombie went down the well. We got to get him out, or it's going to contaminate the drinking water." What's I'm just that sitting there like, a "Zombie in the well?" Hate to fucking tell you that things down there pissing and shitting in the well the whole time. <laughs> oh no, it's the, contaminated. The water supply, Matt. <laughs> we hadn't <laughs> well, thought about like, it. The water tastes season. Yeah. How is it? Oh, just no. human. Oh no! <laughs> but they're, they're like they what, like get him up and then he rips in half as they take him out of the well and I'm like, yeah, it was contaminated to begin with. There was a big fucking waste of time. And anyway, the second season was where it all kind of started. Did you write the devs? Or? I did. I, I wrote. I wrote them. <laughs> I wrote. I wrote the devs. <laughs> the message boards are going crazy. Write the writers. Yeah. Yeah. The devs of TV shows. Yes. Yes. <laughs> no, that's true. Yeah. yeah. And if you're religious or spiritual, perhaps there is a dev for life. There's a bunch of glitches, I'll tell you that. Oh, yeah, <laughs> Definitely. Oh, dude, have you all seen any Matrix stuff or no? Speaking of which. I've seen the first three films. Oh, well, I saw some behind the scenes of <laughs> the new Matrix movie. Oh, okay. Yeah. There's like... You've never seen any of them, nope. right? You were saying that the other day. No okay, shit. Perfect example, right? You said that, and someone's like, oh, you gotta watch it. And I was just like, I don't I don't know if he'll get it, right? Yeah. Like, like, honestly, like, I can yeah, watch I The Matrix know. now, like, like, right, and be I'm like, I mean, I love this, yeah. right? Yeah. Because it's just like, I remember, I, I, it was revolutionary. I, I watch it as I remember when this was crazy. Yeah. Right? yeah. But you watch it now, and it's not like, 
if you come, if you go watch The Matrix and then you watch Spider Man three, and you haven't seen either one, it's like, well, what the fuck were they doing in The Matrix, <laughs> right? <laughs> but when you we're, watch it, going like, I remember stuff. when. The, like again, the Matrix was so popular with the crazy shit they did with like cinematography and CGI yeah. and shit like that. Like that shit was parodied for like ten years. Yeah. Like yeah. that shit's in Shrek, yep. right? Where like Fiona like jumps <laughs> yeah. and like just the three sixty game. Yeah. Like mm -hmm. that literally had never been done before. Yep. If you didn't see that, like you've seen a million other movies do that yeah. before seeing the Matrix. I just like. Then you, then you I, wouldn't think it was like any, like any right? I, and it's not even like yeah, you don't get it. It's like how could thing. you expect someone to appreciate that, right? So yeah. someone telling Matt, you gotta watch a Matrix. I was like, it's well, not even like old. filming yeah. tech. The tech behind Matrix is already amazing, but also on top of that, just like the prediction for what the future was going to be like, what kind of tech we would have, like how how heavily ingrained the internet would be in our day to day life, and like that's how we live now. So and thankfully, gives like I, I will give the Matrix credit beyond like what they did, but however they did it, it holds up. Oh like, yeah, it's great. There's movies you watch like yeah. in the early 2000s and it's like this looks terrible like as far as cg and stuff like the first harry potter it's for several bad. harry it's potters where you're just like yeah you know it's it's the equivalent now of watching think... the painted backgrounds yeah. in the 2000s where you go this looks terrible anyway time to watch the phantom menace it's perfection. And then you look at it now and you go, holy shit, this whole Yikes. movie looks fucking terrible. And then you realize... Like, like Matrix <laughs> doesn't really have a lot of that, you know? Like, it actually looks good however they shot it. It's like Jurassic Park. Oh, yeah. Jurassic, Jurassic Park looks great. amazing, right? Because yeah. they they were like, we'll do a little bit of, like, whatever computer Same technology they had. CGI, we'll, do, right. we'll do a lot of animatronics. And it just holds up. It doesn't look like... You know, Shit. lost in time, like a dinosaur coming to get you, you know, <laughs> but there's a lot of movies that do. And you just go, man, mm -hmm. the early 2000s are not good. Did there's so many it? people just went, uh, we can do anything for cheap. Didn't you have a nugget of thought on that as well or not? Oh, what? Oh, no, just CGI. On any of that? Yeah. On CGI? Yeah, CGI back then was terrible. It was just, it was just, it came out and people went. It's well, easy, it's yeah. cheap, and no one will ever know. But then, like, quality, <laughs> yeah, quality of, not even just CGI, up. but, like, televisions <laughs> and HD it, and, like, all that shit got invented. It was basically live-action Aqua Teen Hunger Force. Right, right, right. Yeah. Well, the, the two that stick out to me of, like, early 2000s CGI where you're like, oh, that did not hold up is the show Reboot and Butt Ugly Martians. Because God, did oh, those look okay. horrible. I mean, but like, but like, even those, yeah. those, those were like yeah. just straight up yeah. animated. Oh yeah, right. Well, that's art. That, I mean, <laughs> that's, those, I, those I, are I terrible. Love it. I'm just like, I looked at, it, I'm like, this used to look cool. Yeah. Those like early yeah. like, I remember. Uh, <laughs> those, those were like the, awesome. the weekend, you know, morning cartoon shows. And it, again, that's an error of like this weird ass 3D um, kind yeah. of style. But again, even that. You can you can still look at that and just go that's the show period. Mm -hmm. But it's stuff like movies that use computer. It's like that's a man, that's a computer, that's not mm -hmm. real, that doesn't exist. And it's uh, you, you sit there and wonder. I go like, man, twenty years from now is that the MCU? Right? Like in twenty four, yeah, we're like yeah. we're like Endgame is fucking terrible. You know what I mean? Yeah, like yeah. when the TVs were like hyper watching them and we can see like every single <laughs> pixel. Yeah. Oh my child! It's just like. Oh, that's that's the early 2000s. And I, and I feel like as, um, you know, HD became more and more popular of like 1080 and 4K and all that shit. We got like filmmakers and stuff got to 2010. And they were like, yo, people can see this shit. You gotta <laughs> stop, you gotta stop <laughs> doing this. Can see. They, yeah. It looks bad. Well, we need to stop. A Even bit. more embarrassing than that is like, you know, we can all be honest about like, you know, fictional crushes Don't, we've had and man. stuff. It's really sad now, like, looking back. Like, pull up that image again, please, if you don't mind, of the reboot cast. When I think about it, I'm like, I had blue, a crush right? on, like, Those three of these right motherfuckers. And they look like this. And yeah. they're like, why? Oh, it's like, it looks like Roblox characters. That's, yeah. that's right. It's, 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 going, it's I want to be your wonder. imagination right. where you're like, I can imagine them as real. Like Final Fantasy VII yeah. Cloud, the original, not the remake, yeah. where you're like, ooh, those pit, mm, you're so square and angular. This guy doesn't have a mouth, but that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> like, we'll you know, figure a way out. The appeal of Lara Croft <laughs> back in the day, you know, yeah. like, those titties were triangular. Yeah, dude. Boy. Yeah, Started. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, you know, there's the cheat code. Yeah, she put the pyramids in her bra. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the pyramids she explored. Oh, <laughs> she shrunk them down. Yeah. Uh, she, Genius. She gets to the heart. Shirt. She's like, finally, <laughs> there we are. It's a souvenir. Oh my god, goodness. Uh, first fictional crush, everyone. Yes. 
I feel like I know oh, Matt's, but maybe I'm wrong. You've asked me this, and I don't remember what I said. Um, I know we bonded over Yu Gi Oh, but that's a little crap. Well, I mean, yeah. Especially like. Mai's obviously. Like, yeah. you know. Mai, yeah. yeah. I mean, come on. Uh, come on. Uh, Gabumon? Or... Yeah, hey, there you go. go. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Gabumon used what to always fuck? be like, Ooh, I'll always be here for you, Matt. And I was like, yeah. he's talking about me. Oh, whoa. <laughs> Yo, he, you. He means me. Like, don't get me wrong. Ty, Ty was like an yeah. asshole, but then also, like, Matt was a baby. Matt was a bitch. Yeah, Matt yeah. Was a little... They were the original Harry and Ron. <laughs> Guys, stop fighting. Okay? You have courage and friendship. Stop fighting. And then, and then, uh, Gabu Mon and Agumon were just kind of like, like what do we there, do? And they were just like, bro, this sucks. Like, they didn't fight at all. They they like, all. bro, I'm yeah. sorry, Taz being a baby. He's like, yo, Matt, he straight up cried last night. This shit's wild. <laughs> anyway, I guess we're gonna go live in the ice or something. <laughs> they held hands I'll see you later. <laughs> see you later. Yeah. Ty's like, I'm gonna turn you into a skeleton because I'm pissed at the You say game. they were Eat the all our food, and Ron. Digital. Yeah. If anything, they were the new Raphael and Leonardo. Huh. Um, but not really though. But look, Le I'll be honest. Leonardo wasn't really an asshole. That was all huh. Raph. Ra Raphael was the yeah. asshole, but Leonardo My leads. That's the point. Push. Yeah, I know. R right. It's the but, leader but, versus the I should be the leader. Right. But Ty Ty Ladin was also kind of a prick sometimes. Leo yeah. always yeah. made sense. I blame four kids. Raph probably. was like, I'm violent. <laughs> oh, he wasn't. <laughs> I'm angry. I want to stab people. I I have knives. <laughs> and you let me never stab let me kill people. With and them. Leo's like, never. I'm Stop great. It. Donatello's and, uh, like, computer's almost done, guys. Right. And then Raph was like, I want to lead. And Leo's like, bro, you're whack. Whoa. Stop. And then he left. Then he come back and go, oh, I'm sorry. Hard W. I'm sorry, I got mad. <laughs> Did you? I got ever... beat up by some guy in the park with a bat. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, man, what's up? Did you ever play the original Digimon World game? Oh, yeah. On oh, yeah. oh, yeah, dude, where you got to train oh, them. Yeah, and, and, shit? and literally, like, oh, when yeah. you get in the first just fight, you're just poop. like, Y you're uh -huh. you whatever you want to do. Also, Fight. also, also, um, you know, having the show already existed, you go that you don't turn into that. Yeah. What the fuck? There's only like <laughs> there's the, a, there's the only weird. like five starters, and he goes mm -hmm. this turns into one of nine things, and you go what? It was like right. the weird thing. Where like they, they kept it off that like old Digimon. That was how they picked the yeah. Digimon for it. And it then could be like, Greymon or I guess uh, I don't know this. Poop thing, <laughs> Anamon, or like, um, I don't know, Leomon, I guess. You know, <laughs> I don't know, we got, we got to get some from, of the ones wait, in here. Wait, Agumon can turn into yeah. Leomon? <laughs> also, real Shit, I best say, I gotta go do the fighting roulette board again. Yeah. <laughs> I need to play this game, it's amazing. It's poop time. On it's, it's so didn't weird. Didn't Nanamon oh, eat up. the poop, too? Nanamon would eat if the poop. If you had him, he would yeah. just eat yeah. all the poop on the floor. If you didn't have him, though, it just stayed there for forever. Yeah. Well, yeah, you had to take him to the bathroom. Yeah. If you didn't get it. It out. Bing! First bell. I don't. I don't know oh. if it was coming. <laughs> Did you like that? Did you tell the future? It's good. Uh, He's, I didn't. Knows, no, I commanded it actually, <laughs> uh, desperately. Well, here we are at the end of the year. Well, we've gone on okay. such a journey on this podcast alone. Was. Celebrated. Talked about how much we hate anything old. Yeah, we uh, once again we went, we, the we went from we went from. Casablanca sucks to like, bro, Digimon? Hell yeah. <laughs> right. People are breaking their computers right now, throwing we're, their phones. We're, we're connoisseurs of art. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Truly. But not Digimon in black and white. Quit, quit. can't do that. Yeah. Hold on, uh, Matt, Matt's on to something. We're going to watch Digimon well, in black and white, know, everybody. Hang but on. If, you go did, if you did stick That's with it. us, much appreciated, first members. Uh, we did it. Another year. On to 2022. Um, and now with know, more Joe. I don't know. With more Joe? With mm -hmm. more me? With more. Yeah. Um, I'd say like 100% more okay. Joe. Well, I, don't, yeah. I don't know about Well, that. yeah. Compared to last like, year? It, honestly, I, yeah, yeah, I would guess it's probably, if it was 100% more Joe, I'd go, that's it. Like, oh, that's, yeah, like, like, what is that? Sorry. That'd be like 2%. five, four percent. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Joe's going to be in five videos. Rookie numbers. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness. Please partake in the first shows available and brand new first. Well, actually, is it a first? Is the W show a first show? I think it is, right? Oh my God. Uh, the W show? Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Probably is what he said. Oh, brand new, confer brand new first show. I knew that. Uh, coming out, I think it's January, right? It's supposed to start airing. It's exciting stuff. 
Um, you're there. Yeah, you're there. You're, you're there. there. Yeah, you're here. I'm here. Right. Yeah. Um, I don't need to be here and there. You'll be. You'll be there. I'm on the everywhere. Next one. Yeah. Not that, but mm -hmm. um, I'll be floating around. Like an omnipresent Superman. being. Yeah. Well, it's good. I don't know. First. I don't know. Like it's, hey, hey, first hey, man. hey. I'm gonna be a pal. Just keep your glasses on. First member. Don't recognize you. And in fact, if you're if you are a first member, you don't even you don't even understand that because I was in the ad read and you didn't see it. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> so now, if you did see the ad, it's the perfect time to sign up for first. Like I got the pal. Now I'm a first. We're good. Um, and then I don't know. I'm tired. Like not just like today, like forever. Yeah. You know what I mean, yeah, I look I back and you. Look different. Me? Yeah. yeah. Matt got a haircut. Yeah, no, I meant out. from five seconds ago. I feel no. like I looked at <laughs> Matt. Matt went like this. He did the Robert did, Pattinson did, tussle. Like yeah. well, you went. What are you talking about? Followed by. Oh yeah, I did something. Well, I mean, it wasn't I'm like just saying. Like now you're crazy. just like. Here. Mm -hmm. I will say I'm getting like an errand from Game Grumps vibe now, and I'm all oh, about that. Okay. Yeah. I thought I'll, it was I'll a scream a bit more. There you go. Um. I'll say since last week, just okay. in my humble opinion, uh, nothing was done about the temperature in this room. No. And there's no, still no water still... cooler. <sighs> How do you guys? It's, this sucks in here. It's I'm so hot. It's so hot, but I feel fine and I'm wearing a sweater. God, don't, don't even get me started. Oh, yeah. BK, BK, that's what BK, BK and Matt too. Yeah. Matt's always yeah. wearing shit. But I mean, Matt says like, he's hot and then just. I know! I last week, BK's like, ah, slow chill. And I went, you're making me hot. Just being next to me, and Matt goes, "Yeah, it's hot." As he's wearing a jacket, I don't I, understand I it. The sleeves up, to be fair. Oh, that's true. But, well, yeah. what else could you do? <laughs> it's impossible. No, the thing is, when I take it that's off, I still have to go back through that other room, and it's freezing in there. So you put it back on what? when you, Matt? We're here for like two hours. What? The one? Oh, I have to put it back on. When I, off, what? Am I gonna take a jacket on and off every two hours? Yeah. Yeah. I don't want to acclimate. Acclimate? Wow. Why can't humans shed skin when we're hot? Because that'd be gross. Is that the out? Is that it? Answer well, me. Well, like, then everyone would complain about dandruff. Also, oh. also, but like, do you think this? Like yeah. think the skin Here's my dandruff is for the day. <laughs> well, your epidermis. I mean, in a way, right? I'm just saying, I, in your body, probably a lot of the flesh. I would argue is that's your yeah. epidermis, bro. Right. Mm. Yeah. No, that's get your dermis, your epidermis, and that makes your flesh, right? Am I wrong? Plus your muscle groups. Uh, I feel like so. I feel like you're really flesh. leaning into skin a lot. <laughs> I though, like skin. Your dermis. The closest skin, thing I ever got not, to taking I don't know. Doing I just don't know. So I don't really know. Oh, there we go. I know what word you just said. What is that? What is there a Ziminator? Michael's not familiar. He's never played it. Fun. You know. Never would. Do you know? Of course you know. No, it wasn't that word. It was the Page and Dr. Free and Dr. Jones, Theo. Yeah. You gonna finish being a fish, by the way? <sighs> Barely started, Matt. Oh, yeah. boy. You That's... finish it? Uh, can I? Yeah. Look, I, I got so many obstacles to overcome. Gavin. That's a big Sarah, one. Sarah, the other room. That, there's a lot this of obstacles. crazy. Black and white films. <laughs> I'm right. I'm not a, I'm not a magician. Okay? <laughs> I was just wondering. What do you want, what do you want from me? I enjoyed the playthrough. What do you... What do you want? I from want me? you to be a okay. Fit. I like. I get great. I like <laughs> it. <laughs> I gotta play Halo. Yeah, you just you're just on my own. I know. I just want to play the game. I I'd, I'd, to play this morning. I'd, I'd wait for co-op, but you know, who knows when that's coming? You know, rumored yeah, to be March. The rumor. They'll probably rumor. make you pay for it too. I don't think. I, don't think <laughs> I mean, I mean, they're making us pay for it, just not monetarily. <laughs> we'll make you pay in time. Five dollars. We'll, we'll, we'll make you pay four months of just going. Hey, you, hey, you know the the next Halo came out. You're really excited to play it. You want to experience that for the first time with your friends? Nah. Play it by yourself or wait four months. Well, you decide. <laughs> and then and then everyone goes. I guess I'll play it by myself. <laughs> like choice. like for. Even as I fell off of Halo as just in a sense of like not being a teenager, being like, I can play Halo for thousands of hours, you know, it was always like campaigns coming out, get it at midnight, play it with the same four people. And I did mm. that with like every single Halo. And I didn't do that with like five. I don't even know if I did it with four. I think I did it with four. Five might have been the first one I didn't do it. No. But it's just the idea of being like, new Halo's coming out, get together and just go, 
Oh, it's not. There's no co-op. <laughs> I got it at midnight. Me too. Let's all well, play it at the same time and pretend like we're in the same. Yeah, like syncing up a Netflix movie. Here we go. Three, yeah. two, Three, two, one, one campaign. Play. I'm a little. A little heavy wait, 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 wait. I'm a little, a little bit slower. Wait, than you. what are you? I'm a legendary. I'm a normal. What? <laughs> Which Stop. Slow speed? down. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I mean, I mean, it'll still be really fun. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it was, I'd still just, interesting move. There's more time for me to 1v1 Joe and Apex. I, I don't know. Oh. Maybe happen. How that's relevant yeah. to Halo it's, campaign at all. Uh, in uh, the sense that I would die in either. Lindsay, yeah. Lindsay, yeah. Lindsay yeah. 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 me to 1v1 in Apex. <laughs> did, uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's what Ralfredo uh, said. He's like, what? uh. <laughs> Probably lose. Um, More than likely, yeah. yeah. When does the challenge does the challenge start before <laughs> you're at the game? Because I think it might be like I challenge you one v one on Apex. Ready? Go. Oh, I broke your legs. <laughs> you know what I mean? Well, you know what I'm saying? Your real legs. I yeah, but I mean, like, if the game starts while you're still like, you know, crawling under the computer, they might have an advantage. Joe suddenly I'm got just saying, sick, and it's unfortunate. You know, um, or it's like, <laughs> or if, or if it's like, smack on the back I'll one v one you in Apex, right, but then when time. the game's over, you have to <laughs> go to this other room and push a button. It's like, oh yeah, you won. You're never leaving. <laughs> I've been taking some like that. I could wrap my head around. <laughs> Christ. Um, we're done here. Okay. Uh, wow. Abrupt. Asking, abrupt. Sorry. Yeah. Right, well. For the power of editing. Well, we, well, I mean, we started late, so. Oh, I didn't know. Didn't okay, sorry. Have such a hard out, but if you just. Hate the pals so much. No, I made a Tanya Harding joke, and I feel like that's how we end this. So, don't joke about that. Okay. She had it. She had it rough. You Have you me. seen I Tanya? I never saw it. <laughs> no. I just could. I couldn't. Who? What? I love Margaret Tanya, Robbie. Yeah. But, uh, Tanya I'm Harding, the you. one who had oh. Nancy Kerrigan's yeah. legs bashed in. Piece of shit oh, human I, being. Um, Full stop. <laughs> but like, then they made a movie, and I yep. was just like, ah, but but for real, like outside, I, like she sucks. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, well, I just can't. I just can't. I just. There was analysis of the movie, which I totally resonate with, where they said, like, it's kind of weird that we've, like, made this person who did something really shitty, like, you know, you, we can argue whether or not she was, like, the mastermind behind it. I think she was. Um, you know, yeah. Uh, but people were like, oh, no, like, you make her sympathetic in this moment, and you've, like, made her... You've sensationalized her and also made her almost like a fictional character. Like, these people... I saw a lot of people who, who, after the movie, were like, oh, no, she didn't stand a chance. Like, her life was really shitty. And that's why she hired someone to beat the shit I mean, out the of her like, again. You're like, oh, hang on. Like, no, hold on. It explains no. it. Hold on. The thing, well, yeah. the thing about that, is like, but the thing exactly. about that also yeah. is, like, you can even argue with a documentary of, like, well, that's how they pitch it. Right. This isn't even... It's a, just a movie. This is a biopic. A movie about yeah. like an entertain, it was yeah. an entertainment movie, right? right? Though it's yeah. not even, like, a documentary and them yeah. saying, you know, this, that, whatever. Like, it's a Hollywood movie. And it's just, like... Oh, that's, like... Even if, again, it's not fully sympathizing with the character, it's just, like, oh, that person sucks. Mm -hmm. it's, <laughs> it's, it's just, like... Oh, it's, we got, <laughs> and then, like, we got Margot Robbie, and she's, like, amazing. Everybody she's loves great. Margot yeah. Robbie. Yeah. And it's, like... Oh, I can't wait to see her be this piece of shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you did it's, so well. It's yeah. Wow. Like, now yeah. I like now I like, so, I yeah. like Tanya Harding because like, I like Marvel. Sold to <laughs> I mean, imagine, By proxy. Imagine if, if Tanya Harding had gotten one. Oh my god. Yeah, he would have talked her I out. Can't I can't it. imagine. Yeah. I cannot. Know, Tanya, don't don't do that. God, yeah, where were you when you needed the most? Don't do ice cream. I was like always whisper talk. He was and then Matt would always be like sleeping under his fur and shit. Like I can't remember. He didn't like take it off, but it was like yeah, what, what, it, was, it was like it was loose. A, it was a jacket. About it. Oh, yeah, like, why yeah. is Gabumon's was... voice so like soothing and awful? Oh, like, ah! yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, he died. I died. Yeah. Yeah. He was just like happy go lucky. Why. He yeah. says he talks. I think like that. I think Gabumon knew though. He's like, oh, my fuck, I, I gotta. My kids got shit. My kids got shit. I gotta calm this kid down the whole time, you know. Matt, don't go crazy. Just don't take care of your brother. He's like, do it. Oh yeah, I didn't forget about that. TK yelling at TK. Well, you're all listening to the wrong thing. It's all about Gatomon. I'm listening to her, so you know. Couldn't notice. Did she mega evolve? Didn't think so. No. Still in champion. What? Get to mega evolve. That worm on life, though. Well, I'll always oh, be there for worms. Ken. Like, Ken, kick my ass. <laughs> Please, Step on Ken. me. Ken, I love you. <laughs>
Oh, you're enslaving the entire <laughs> digital race? That's okay. Oh, dude, I know you're, you're a nice guy. Yeah, you have the Christian cake. I see you cry oh. at night. Yep. <laughs> that makes you a little kick. Oh, yeah, yeah kick me more, Ken. <laughs> I'm Stingmon. Kick me, pick me up. Stingmon was Why so you sad. beat my ass? And then the entire wizard mom. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, I'll bet that, like, then, then they go, <laughs> then though. they go, all right, yes. let's, you know, Ken's like this prick, and he's like this soccer protege. Bro. He's better than Davis, and Davis is good. And like, Whoa, he's oh. this protege. And then, and then you go, fuck Ken. And they go, yeah, your brother's dead. And then you oh. go, oh. oh, I'm sorry, well. Ken. And then at the end of the season, you can be in the main, like, the oh. main crew. Come on, <laughs> oh. get over here. Shit, now I'm gonna go fuck up these ones and zeros, <laughs> and the, which which I get too. He's going, it ain't real. But then they they're just screaming, please God, we're real, please, we we're real. And he's going, shh, nah, shut up, Mom. And he's like, oh, Ken. Well did he had You're that like, my realization zero. when like he saw the Digimon <laughs> in the real world? Right? He, he, had, he had the yeah, realization yeah. like so. years after he was an yeah. evil like, emperor. Yeah. Like, yeah. Like, he went, what? It's not a game. Well, was like, yeah, when, like, <laughs> like, was like in bro, hanging bro, out with TK for real. He's bro, like, we told you. Wait, <laughs> kill puppy. I was wait, killing. Wait, real. those what? Oh. those came into the real bro, world. Like, I'm from the real world, oh which means they must was bad. Be real, and I was. I kicked Wormon so much. <laughs> Bro, he always kicked yeah, me. He did. <laughs> With boots! I know. Okay, go away, go away. And then Wormon's like, oh, it's is, okay, Ken. Is Myotismon the giant Digimon who looks like Dracula? I'm yes. blanking right yeah. now. Yeah. Okay. That's, well, I mean, he wasn't giant. He, he was just kind of regular. He was just kind of a human, mm -hmm. yeah. tall right. human. Yes. Giant was Venom Myotismon. Yeah. He was like Godzilla. He was Fair very, enough. very big, yeah. yeah. I just like, I think it was the fight with him and Anjumon where like someone shucked food at Anjumon and he was like, take this. And he goes, I'm not hungry. Psh, and, like in the dub. <laughs> yeah, and I was like, yeah, hungry. fuck yeah. Dub is not <laughs> Awesome. They, <laughs> we don't talk about that. They, okay, hang on. It was a dub. Yeah, you got a blanket winning. statement. Okay. Yeah. Digimon dub, not good. No. <laughs> I mean, but well, funny. that's why that's what I was saying. Agumon! Right, right. I, that oh, show God. particularly. I, well, again, I, it's not even just the voice acting. It's like the the rewrites, where it's just like, eh, yeah. yeah. I guess I guess in the original script he says like, I'm gonna suck your soul out now. Um, but in the English dub, it's like, I'm gonna know, give you a big boo boo. I don't know. He not <laughs> even. Right. I don't know. You guys, I guess I guess this guy sounds like Elvis. Oh yeah. I guess oh, Adam yeah. just says and, and instead of saying long. instead of saying I'll destroy everything, I'll kill you, I'll suck your soul, it'll go, hey there, pretty mama. <laughs> Bro, awesome. Yeah. Don't, Write it. Don't even get me started on the, the show. The Dava. What the fuck? The Diva. Why? Like, oh, little oh, digitestin. Ho, oh, I'm coming at you. Right. What? Why is this giant <laughs> with sunglasses sound like Elvis? What the hell is happening? Got to appeal to the American and that's 2020. No. That's us. Yeah. Did it appeal? Who yeah. watched that one? I love it. King, How do you not love Fuck. the king? Fair enough. The, Fair the enough. Venn diagram of Elvis fans and Digimon season one. There's a lot of crossovers. <laughs> you would expect Basically it. a straight line. <laughs> it's actually incredible. God damn. And then you're watching and they go, it, he's all shook up. <laughs> oh my God. There he is. So uh, Digimon watch party, oh. everyone? Uh, I'm good, I would, actually. Um, well, you know what? Would, it lives in here. Unless it's Digimon Tamers. No, no, yeah, is very absolutely. Good. Or Frontier. Say, your age is showing, Joe. What? Because that you were alive when that was out. <laughs> I was alive. You were like two when Digimon came out. Yeah, but I watched it when I grew up. Okay, yeah. yeah. I think you I was. Saw I went from going. You you were there like, with the I was with doing, the baby Digimon. <laughs> <laughs> you were just, you were, they were blowing bubbles and you were doing spit bubbles. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> when did you get this? Where'd you sneak that from? Earlier, oh, well, like a while ago. Wow, yeah, just comic. Something. This one not great. It's no, okay. I love voodoo. This one, this is a real like. Mm, that's what that tastes like. Interesting. I have my three drinks. I'll as go always. back to every other flavor. <laughs> Voodoo's good though. I like Voodoo. It's very yeah. pretty good. So drink it a lot, and they're not even a sponsor today. But you could be. I choose you, Voodoo Mon. <laughs> Best Digimon. He'd probably have like a southern accent. <laughs> <laughs> or he could just be Elvis. Am I right? <laughs> I don't understand. It's like, hey, here's this guy. What do you think he sound like? How about this? Fuck it. I don't care. Sure. Yeah. That's How many episodes is he in? A hundred? Oh. What? Well, well, well. <laughs> <laughs> he made a uh, I'm going to be honest with you. We don't give a shit. 
Oh, then I about what better. this show sounds like. <laughs> Seconds. <laughs> it's like the Ponyta Ranch in Pokemon. And even that yeah. kind of makes sense. They're ranchers. Oh, Ash. Oh, yeah. Get the Ponyta. Oh, the Rapidash got out. Hey, y'all, if you enjoyed this off topic, I'll leave a comment below, thumbs up, click the bell to subscribe and all that shit. Yeah. Are they leaving a comment below and a thumbs up, or is the Both. comment a thumbs up? Yes, the comment should be a thumbs up. <laughs> That's, That's all I want. <laughs> Last yeah. thoughts on the year? Um, oh, yeah, I'm just glad that we talked about so many things that were relevant to 2021. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or Digimon. Well, Spider-Man <laughs> came out this year. <laughs> <laughs> you know I mean? Came out this year. We got this Tim and Eric and Hirasha yeah. Digimon. We're nailing yeah, it. Yeah, we got it. We're nailing it. Spider-Man was. Spider-Man did. Spider did come the out. The show's called Off Topic, not we're going to talk about what just happened. That's true. There was not much to talk That's, about with uh, yeah. it. Probably yeah. another show. I'll be honest too. If you were like, how is it 2021? I go, uh, I, to, I, I summarized 2021 as I got to leave my house. There you yeah. go. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's a good true. highlight. There, yeah. Yeah. We should we should continue that trend. Yeah. So Matt can get his nice haircut. Yeah. Yeah. More than you know, once every six months. Ideally. I think three. Three it is. Pretty good. Are we done. Oh, 2021 is pretty good, huh? Yeah. Why don't we have any poppers? Too messy. That's smart. Fair answer. He said too messy. Yeah. Why not have it? Why, why don't we have any bottle rockets? I have a it's hard true. time it's believing Texas. that would be. <laughs> <laughs> Roman candles? And anyone? Yeah. Well, you would just have. Yeah, but he wouldn't well, know for two weeks. Got some black I mean, stab. Would John Mace kill you or would the fire? Oh. Mm. See, if the fire gets you first. Why would you go there? If the fire gets you first. <laughs> Matt and I want to die by fire. I'm gonna. I'm straight up gonna wake up next what? year. I'm out of here. Okay. It's, I tried to clean it. It's still. I got yeah, it sticky it's, immediately. It's, it's it pissed me off. Though. I've been in a bad mood the whole time. The table's sticky. I'm sticky. Get the. It's pissing me off. He needs a goblin. Huh? He does. Calm him down. End the show. <laughs> well, oh, Chris was looking for candy earlier. If we want to give him more candy. Chris Demiris came by and he said, do you guys have candy? And I went, I, I don't know. And then Barbara was behind him. I said, hey, Chris just came by looking for candy. Is that for something you're filming? And she went, no. <laughs> I just want candy. Can't blame for that. I get it. Good bar? Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>